Hey, we're live. Hey, hey. But I stop dancing. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Greg from Balloon Market here. And oh, I forgot to take my glasses off. I'm going to put my glasses down here. Yeah, Greg from Balloon Market. Welcome to BMTV Live. Hey. And Sorry. Right, let me do my <laughs> bit. You can join in for a second. Excited. As you can see, it's a Qualitex digital demo day here today. And we're joined by Julie, who's very excited, clearly, <laughs> and, and Lucy. And uh, there was somebody else as well, but she's a bit shy, but I'm going to make her come on, on, on screen now. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Everybody, you might not have met Debs before. This is Debs. Hello. Now, actually, Debs doesn't realize this, but I'm going to head off now and she's going to be No, I'm joking. Anyway, thank you, Debs. I know, I, know, I know you don't like, you hated that. But anyway, everybody, <laughs> hello. I hope you're all right. Um, right, this is the first time we have done this. Um, properly, obviously, we did the test last week to check that the technology worked. Um, we imagine it's a demo day, normal demo day. So you rock up and you're talking to, to these guys and you're asking them questions, watching what they're doing, all of that sort of stuff. That's really what it's all about. And I'll be here to read some of the questions on the screen. Hopefully, have we got some? We've got some comments already. This oh, is okay. so exciting. Woohoo! Hi, Greg. Hi, hi, girls and Greg. Kerry Ferguson, anybody know who Kerry Ferguson nah, is? No. Nah. <laughs> hello, Kerry. And uh, that was Maz who said, woohoo, hi, Greg. So hello, Maz. And Colby's mum gave us, I think that's thumbs up and a heart. Oh, thanks. Um, so if you do have any questions, please, please put them in the comments, either on Facebook, on YouTube. We will see those on the screen in front of us. And we will be able to, I'll hopefully be able to ask the questions if I can read it. I might need my glasses. Yeah, I can't and, read and, and you guys are just going to... Um, do we're stuff, just gonna do stuff. Make stuff as you stuff. would with demo day. So we're going to start off with Julie. So Lucy, we'll get to you. Thank you. <laughs> Don't trip over anything. No. Don't trip over anything. Could all go horribly wrong. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, back up. All right. Okay. Um, so what are we going to do? <laughs> so we're going to start with the baby revealed stand. So there's quite a lot of different versions of baby revealed yeah. stands. Um, I'm going to do one that i think is is really nice it's used in a 16 inch qualitex um question mark balloon yep and um a deco bubble 
and some of the things that's in that bag. Oh, you want me to pass this to you? Yeah, just, yeah, let's start with the base, actually. Apparently, Julie's going to get me doing stuff. Yes. Which is quite, quite unusual. All right, so this is going oh, to be... Bex, hey, sorry, I'm going to be reading these. I'm just going to be disturbing you all the time. <laughs> um, oh, Kerry's corrected the Greg. Thanks, Kerry. Um, hello, hello. Hello from Alabama, USA. Sweet home. Um, Jackie Young. Charles Bond. Hello, everybody. Anyway, if you've got any questions, I'm not saying we're going to answer all of them straight away, but I'll read them. I'll try and get to them. Um, but anyway, sorry. Carry on. Okay, carry, carry on. on. I'm just excited. That you can <laughs> I'm see excited things. too. I can't read that though, so I can't get right. too excited. <laughs> I've got my glasses on. All right, so I've made a cluster of four, and this is inflated to about eight inches. Okay. Um, and then I'm going to put another cluster on top, which is three pumps, and I'm just going to join them together using um, the the neck from the balloons yep. underneath and do a figure of eight. I really like the chrome to make. Um, do you want me to take these out? Not yet. No, I don't need them quite yet. I will do soon. I've messed up already. We're going we're gonna to do something quite messy. Okay. I know you like me doing messy oh, things. No. Okay. As long as there's none of that gold, flaky stuff. Oh, no. This is much worse. Oh. Great. But I'm going to try and contain it. Is there no balloon in there? <laughs> oh, I was going to show me that. That is hilarious. Show me, show me, show me, show me, show me. That is brilliant. That's a good start. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me. It's... <laughs> this is live, ladies and gentlemen. Um, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight moisture packs and no balloon. Oh, no. Wait, wait, wait. Nine moisture packs. <laughs> anyway, that was a great start, wasn't it? <laughs> Anyway, we did we did not plan that. Anyway, carry on. Fingers crossed for this one. <laughs> that looks like one moisture pack and a bubble bubble. Oh, oh. oh I'm all hot. I'm having hot. Oh, sorry, touch my now. microphone. <laughs> Okay, right. So one of the things we want to do is we want to prevent getting a lot of air in this. Yeah. So I'm going to not put any air in it at all. I'm going to roll my 16 inch up. And I want to try and poke it through. There. Like this. And when I get it so far, I can just grab it to pull it down to where I want it to be. Right, I just want to make sure the, um, the neck is quite open up. So I'm just yep. going to use my balloon straw. This balloon straw, this is a, a different version to the one I had last time. This has come from um, one of my customers um, about it? five years ago. What is it? And it's been like, it's a balloon stick, I think. Or it's half of a balloon Sparkly. stick. Sparkly. Yeah, but it's quite nice. Very nice, yeah. That was from um, Gary from Lily Bazaar in oh. Liverpool. So thank you, Gary. Hi, Gary. If you're watching. Right, I'm just going to make sure I've got no air in that. So I'm just going to squeeze it all out. Right, this is where it can get a little bit messy. Are you ready? Hold on, I'm reading comments. <laughs> do you want me to carry on? Debbie Langdon has said she's never seen that before either. Never seen what? That, what, what do you mean, seen what? Have you forgotten about it already? Oh, yeah, I've moved on. <laughs> move on. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to use a funnel. Oh, is this the messy bit? Yeah, it can be. All right. So this is a perfect size for this. It just fits nice and tight in there. And then this is the Lomi powder. So this is the paint that they use on like fun runs and stuff. You know, oh, yeah, 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 um, yeah. I'm good. Oh. What did I say? Lomi. Lomi. Yeah, I'm sorry. I keep calling it Lomi powder. I've been like doing Lomi. it all week. So what's it called? It's, it's called holy powder. Holy powder. Holy. How do you spell that? H-O-L-I, <laughs> everybody. Not Lomi like the dishes. Okay. <laughs> all right. <laughs> There it right, is. Okay. Sorry, <laughs> right, so I want to put, I'm going to put it in to about that point because I know that's about the right amount. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm cover, going to cover the hole with my finger and then put it in. So gender reveal is still really, really popular. Yeah, really, yeah. 
because people keep still having babies. Well, I, I know, but I didn't know if people have moved on from celebrating different ways, but <laughs> oh, I'm just asking questions. <laughs> I'm just replying. So I'm just going to tap it down and then I'm going to use my balloon straw because yeah. it's getting stuck. This is going quite well because when I did this at home at the weekend, I had a little practice and it went everywhere. Did it? it really did. Please don't do that. I'll try. I did think I'm of you because I know you like me making clean. a mess. No, I don't. Oh, steady. Oh, oh. The new desk. Clean up on our one. Have we got any wet wipes? I don't know. Have we got any wet wipes over there? No, we've not got any wet wipes. Oh, yes. Yeah, shall we use the moisture pack? Oh, yeah. Good idea. <laughs> Good idea, look at that, we do have wet wipes. <laughs> oh, you can wipe that from me as well. If you oh, know, oh, I think. This is great, it's all worked out. Yeah, we knew, we just knew we needed lots of moisture. Thanks, packs. Debs, you're a genius. What was that, Lucy? Who, whose idea was that? They're both geniuses. Okay. I'm gonna put that under there so it's safe. There you go, that's another use for your uh, moisture packs. Thank you. Cleaning up after Julie. <laughs> Right, I'm going to put that under there. You just need to make sure you don't get any in the outside of the balloon because obviously it'll be a bit of a giveaway then. Yes. Yeah, good point. Now I'm going to inflate this with my hand pump. I don't want to do it with an electric air inflator because if you're putting it that way, the, the powder's going to yeah, fall yeah. into the air inflator. So this might be a good time for you to look at some comments. Yeah, that, yeah okay. Chloe's mum loves your laugh, apparently. Oh, thanks. It, it's a bit grating after a while. After, after a while? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my word. It's one of the things. Um, you do need to I, I, what do you mean, do it? Take the air out. Oh, they might inflate it. Thanks. I'm not going to do that. Oh, you will be doing that. See, I can take the air out. It's the tying the knot that's the difficult part. Oh, I did it like a. Oh, Oh, one thing I didn't did say, like a pro. Did, did I just, did I say, the with the 16 inch, it's important when you're inflating it into here that you pre-stretch it. Okay. I'm really getting hot and bothered now. So you reckon, have people moved away from the big three foot reveals? Are they no. still doing those? Yeah, I think this is, it depends on what, what the occasion is, you know, like where you're having it, if you're having a big a big thing or if you're um, just doing a little thing at home you know so yeah. if you were doing a big thing and it was going to be outside you could go for like a bigger um design and, and you've put powder in Thank this you. one obviously lonely yeah. powder um <laughs> holy powder and um but you can people put all sorts of things in yeah so. you can put confetti and we do it quite often with confetti um yeah, feathers yeah you could do it with feathers what else Anything that Anything you can else? get in pink or blue that do Balloons, of course, much. balloons. Oh, yeah. balloons. <laughs> it's a good job Lucy's here today, isn't it? <laughs> All right, so I've just wrapped that round like I would do with tying off any other deco bubble. Okay, Tony Barker has asked a question. What size deco bubble are you using on this one, please? 20, 24 inch. But you could do it. Inch, you could do it with a 20 inch. 20 yeah. inches size. I really like 20 inch um, deco bubbles. Actually, I think they're a nice, they're a nice size to give a cute. Right, I'm just going to pull this in to the bottom. Yep. And tie it. Now I want this to sit nice and tight in it, so I'm actually tying it rather than just wrapping it. Michelle says hello. Hello, Michelle Smith. Jonathan Langdon, hello. Okay. Right, so. I'm going to get rid of that rubbish. Did it make you feel better? It, it makes me feel useful, yeah. <laughs> okay, so what I'm going to do, I want to put a little bit more detail on this, so I'm going to put some things going up the sides. Okay. So. I've pre-inflated these. I'm going to use three of them. Oh, we've had another question. 
Um, first of all, for a couple, first of all, Tony. Um, so the reveal balloon inside it is overinflated. Is that right? Yes, it is. It is. But it's fine because it's been pre stretched. Okay. It's so really that's why important. it's important to pre stretch yeah. it. Yeah. So, yes, it is a little bit overinflated. And then the next one is that longer? Um, does it need to be weighted? Yes, it does need to be weighted. Okay. I haven't. These are great. These are great answers. <laughs> they are. Yeah. yeah. No, it would definitely need to be weighed. I'd probably do like a sand weight in there. Yeah, you can do a sand weight, weight, water weight. Yeah. Normal frilly sort of weight. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. There we go. Fab. It's working quite right. well. Getting questions going yeah, on the screen. It? It's yeah. You're quite I'm happy, happy, aren't you? Yeah, I'm very happy. Good. Right. I'm going to plait this now. This is. I don't know the best way to show. Oh, show you've got a bit of gold stuff on it. <laughs> I can't even. It gets everywhere. <laughs> That's a little indication what Lucy's oh, going to be no. doing later. Oh, sorry, I keep whacking you yeah, with you these. Do. You do. Right. Okay. right, okay, so I'm going to plait these. So it's ju I, I just literally do, do it. it. Is that all right? There. Okay. Is that all right? Yep. All right, so I'm going to keep squeezing as I go up just to push the air in. So when you, I've done it so you've got a couple of inches left at yep. the end. Um, and as I go along, I'll squeeze it so they'll, they'll end up okay. moving down. All right, so literally just pl plait in. Just like you do your hair. Yeah. yeah. It was funny, actually, when I went to do this because I can plait my own hair, but I've never really plaited anybody else. So I had to watch myself plait my hair to see <laughs> how, what to do with my fingers. It's a bit weird, isn't it? Yeah. A bit of hair in there. I can't plait my own hair. Like my daughter's no, got can, two daughters. I can get one. Yeah, it's quite hard to one. It's quite a nice effect, isn't it? Yeah, isn't it? You like that. Right, so when I get to the end, what I want to do is just twist them all together like this. Mm-hmm. Oh, and then I'll tripping over health and safety and all. <laughs> right, I'm gonna get rid of these. I'm just gonna put a little twist in, snip that off, and then tie that. We have another question from Michelle. Is that a 160 Q? That's a 260. It's a 260 it? chrome. 260 chrome, Michelle. Chrome are really nice for twisting with. They are. They don't make noise either, do they? So not as much noise. And they're really pliable. They're really they're, yeah. they're nice. I like them. Oh, lost a bit out of there. Should have brought a bin over here. Oh yeah, okay, okay. this one. What's happened? I've lost them in it. Make it right. You should start again if you want to. I have actually got some prepared already. So I can just use those on the design. Well, this is the one I prepared earlier. <laughs> Would you like to do that? And Greg? this one. No, not at all. <laughs> That's empty. Well, no, it's not. It's not it's something else. So I'll take this out. Oh, okay. All right. There's another 260. Well, yeah, I, that was the technique there. That was the technique. That's the important thing. Do you want me to take the air out of this? Or is that not supposed to be in there for any reason? Um, I can't remember. Maybe. All right, okay. I'll take the air out of it. Yeah, anyway, take the air out of it because I probably yeah. will need it. What? Oh, it's your attachment point. Oh, yeah, it is. Thanks, Liz. <laughs> this is live, ladies and gentlemen. We're, we're, we're getting reminders <laughs> off, sort of off screen. Okay, so I'm going to make an attachment point. So do you want the air taken out of it anyway or not? Yeah, please. Is it? Okay. Yeah. Okay, so I need to make an attachment point on the top of here so that I can bring these two round. Yep. And it kind of like... Yes. Hugs it. It's a different type of hug. I like you my do. hugs, don't I? You do. There you go. That's, that's really well taken out. Yeah, it's not bad, actually. Thanks. Do my best. <laughs> right, so I've cut three pieces... Anybody got any more questions out there? It's a demo day. This what do you want to know? Am I going to pop my balloon? I hope you don't you? pop on your balloon. You might. I don't know. This is on your bench. So it might, I don't know how sharp it is. I don't know if I can do this so you can see. 
I mean, do you want to stand on a stool? I'm too small again. I'm all shall I? Let you me could, because you then could. you can see it from above, can't you? If Alex can put it on. <laughs> I'm quite scared up here. Okay. Excellent. Okay, cool. Look at that looks perfect. All right, so I'm just going to lay my 260 there. Don't fall off. Right. You can hold up there, yeah. You don't see this sort of stuff in a live demo game. <laughs> you? No. You turn up. I look short. <laughs> For the first time, I'm taller than any somebody. <laughs> <laughs> so I've just put one piece of stretchy balloon tape across there. Mm -hmm. And then I'm just going to put some smaller pieces just across the end to make sure that it's held nice and secure. Let me get that for you. <laughs> I'm doing it on purpose. I know you are. So how many designs have we got planned for today? One, two, three, four, five, six, wow. seven-ish. Eight. 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 Wow. Oh, I've got another question from Londa again. If you have boy, girl, twins, my family does, can you mix the pink and blue powder? Yes. Oh, Apparently. Yeah. Julie didn't say that. That was, that was Lucy. <laughs> Lucy's off screen. But yes, you can. It's quite a good, good idea. Quite, quite right. Do what, sorry? Oh, Lucy says she does two balloons if it's twins. So you know the twins, but you don't know it's going to be boy, girl, but oh, good one. Ah, uh, yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, like it. Okay, right. So what I want to do is attach it into it and attach it into it. So I'm just going to pull this through with the 260. Work out where I want it to go. And then just pull it in. I'm going to have to pick it up to do it. So what we're planning on do, doing, everybody, is roughly after an hour, we're going to have a break because Julie might need the loo, to be honest. Um, and uh, maybe a cup Not of tea yet. or something like that. Uh, yeah, in, in all likelihood, it might be me that needs the toilet. Um, and then we're going to play some nice music, I think, and then we'll be back after a few minutes. So that's that's the plan. We'll see how it goes. Okay, so then what I'm going to do is take my 260 around this. I think I need to get high up again. Go on, don't fall. Oh, God. You're doing I'm like the clumsiest person on earth. That's great. I, I, we didn't do a full risk assessment with you climbing <laughs> up on things, did we? Please not fall. There may be a better way to do this. I always say this. There may be a better way to do this, but this is how I would do it. Right, so that's nice and tight. As we know in the balloon industry, there's not just one way to do anything, is there? No, there's not. And quite often, if you try and like just make sure that you're doing it the way that somebody else has done it it might not be the correct way for you to do it do you know what yeah. i mean you might find an easier way to do it so it's yeah. just about having um a little play and trial and error oh i've got another question thanks alex how do you know how long to make the plat from mass so, um trial and error i did this um i put four pumps of air into it and just kept working out and seeing if it was right and, okay. it, and it was but i did stretch it as well yeah. so um let me get a 260 and show you it just won't quite long enough and i pre-stretched it yeah make it a bit softer actually we'll do two of these and then you can see one that's been stretched and one that and all right good idea yeah, I do have them every now and then. I'll, I'll hold that, that button. Yeah, nice. 
just love the way she just shoves shoves it in my face. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> you just, you, I thought you were going to do one that you hadn't stretched. The one that no, not stretch like that. Another type of stretching. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you're not making it clear for me. Sorry. You, but you, you'll see stuff. if you observe. I'm observing. I'm observing. Right. Okay. So if you go like this. <laughs> Right, so put that next to that now. And look, you've got another two inches on oh, there yeah. now. Yeah, that's amazing. Clever, isn't it? What are you guys laughing at? I think they're laughing about the two inches. It's a family show. <laughs> You're alive. Please do not swear. Actually making me look like the good girl. <laughs> oh dear. It's the sort of stuff we normally edit out. Gary <laughs> <laughs> seems to find that quite amusing. Have I gone red? I think I've gone red. I feel a bit flushed actually yeah, too. Yeah. <laughs> Diana's made a comment. Every little helps. <laughs> Ah, clearly talking about shopping. <laughs> <laughs> I can see this I going downhill. <laughs> Bex! Oh, I love it when Greg swears. Bex, I'm not going to swear. We're live on TV. TV, on YouTube and Facebook. Right, okay, so. I'm just going to well, Julie was swearing just before we started. <laughs> Is that okay? Yeah, yeah I wasn't we're, swearing. You were swearing I wasn't because swearing. The, I don't the warm up swear. for the mic. So we, we do oh. mic tests before oh, yeah, we start. Swear on that. And I've got a, a traditional mic test that I like to do. And Julie struggled with it. I'm going to tell you what it is. I'm not a pheasant plucker. I'm a pheasant plucker's son. And I'm only plucking pheasants till the pheasant plucker comes. So there you go. And I can't do don't, it. Don't do it. Don't do it now. No, because we, <laughs> we don't want that happening. Whoa. I can't, I can't, is that Marianela? Hello from Honduras on YouTube. Debbie's also finding it quite amusing. I think we have to move on there. Okay, right. Yeah, what on. I want to do is I just want to add a little bit of something in here as well. So I'm going to put a bit of chill because that brings in the white from the question marks oh, into wow. the design as well. Very clever. And we're going to have a go. I want you to make one of these. I'm going to what? You're going to have a go at making one of these. One of these whole... No, I'm, Oh, one of those. Bird. Okay, all right. All you right. can do that, can't you? Yeah, there's a first time for everything. BMTV, I don't have a choice because it's live. <laughs> Normally I'd say I can... no. But, um, yeah. And then we'll pop it. All right. Right, let me just put it's a little go bit of stretch on. No, no, the powder won't go everywhere. So you, so you just... Pop in the balloon inside. Yeah. The bubble, so the bubble won't pop. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Okay. <laughs> no, yes, definitely. Definitely. Right, let's make a bow. I've got I've made one. <laughs> there you go. No. Right, so I really like this technique because you can either make a bow or you can make a pom pom with it. I think it was Sue Bowler showed me how to make a bow. One. Did she? Yeah, I failed miserably. It was it was really, really bad. Sue's probably technique is a little bit more advanced to mine. I think she does it. I think it was she probably does nothing something to do like with... goes like this, don't you? Yeah, she? yeah. I... I think it was my simple mind that struggled with it. Right, I'll tell you what, I'll cut you a length off. Michelle says, remember to put the weight. Need a weight. Oh, it's great. I've been people, I've been assisting. Yeah, it is. That's great. Runners. That's what she yeah, is. She's, she's a, runner. a runner. That's what they call in the movie industry, aren't they? Lucy's a runner. Thank you, Lucy. Thank you. Prepared with a balloon as well already. Oh. Will today's demos be available in the Image Resources Library on the website? Tony, that's a very, very good question, and I am getting the thumbs up from Alex, so yes, it will be. What? You can't leave them, can you? No. <laughs> I, I don't know. Are you going to use these again? Or can no, I throw these? No, okay. Are you sure we don't need them? For... Okay. 
Okay, right. So what we're going to do is we're going to get it. Kripalu is saying, around. I'm looking very pretty. Sorry, it looks very pretty, I think he's saying. <laughs> <laughs> right, you ready? You oh, yeah, no, attention? sorry, I'm not. I'm looking at, I'm oh, looking on, at the things here. Right, okay, so wrap it round. I'm right. Yours will be matter? bigger than me okay. because you've got a bit of a bigger round. So you're literally just trying to spread your fingers out. So you could do this on anything, though. Like you could do it on a side and size, depending, make it bigger or smaller or okay. whatever you want. So just wrap it round. I mean, I can do this. See, it's easy, isn't it? I mean, right. And then take your hand out. Oh, I've got two. I've got two flappy bits. That's fine. No, the flappy bits will look nice. Oh, stop it! <laughs> I think I've got to start again. I quite like it with the flappy bits poking out. Look, I've got them too. My flappy bits were bigger than your <laughs> flappy bits. <laughs> all right. Is that is that all right? Yeah, it's a little bit tight, but that's Oh, God. Is it anything? Anytime I do anything, you say, put it here. I'll put it there. No, not there. <laughs> Remember that? I remember don't, that? No, I don't remember doing that. Put it anywhere you like, Greg, she said. <laughs> yeah. Right, you need the nylon on line now. So take it out. I might need my glasses to see that. Right. So what you need to do is get your nylon on. Can you see? I've got the camera. Oh, I've, got, I've got to read comments now. Hold on. Next time do the no. live after nine o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I know. I'm sorry. I just blame Julie. Could I just say Pioneer Europe? It's not my <laughs> fault. <laughs> it's right, so Lucy's fault. It, we're just gonna... <laughs> right, so I, am I going inside? You just tie it. I'm going around, around it. the outside. Put it down. Okay, I've got to put my glasses back on. Put it down. Yeah. What do I do with this? You put it underneath well, it. You didn't and say then you that, did you? Around. Said, well, you it meant down. to have been watching. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. That's it. All right. Yeah. And then tie it in a knot, nice and tight, and then double knot it. Mm. Oh. When you say double knot it, you mean the... Oh, no, I've lost the other end. Oh. oh I've done this really badly. There you are. You've done that great. And then double it. Yeah. Do the double slippy thing so it doesn't slip. Is that what you <laughs> yeah, mean? the double slippy thing. Oh no, it's slipping. The first one's slipping. Yeah. There you go. Perfect. I mean, that looks rubbish. It needs to be a that... bit tighter, to be fair. This is why I don't do stuff, Julie. No, there you go. <laughs> it's... <laughs> Maz, it's like a carry on film. <laughs> 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 oh dear. Right, okay, so what you can do then, what I like about this is you can either make it into a bow or you can make it into a pom-pom. So if you cut another little bit of chew, you can either tie it round like that. Yeah. Is this yours or mine? Uh, that's mine, isn't it? Because it's is it? rubbish. Okay. Yeah. So we'll make yours into a pom-pom then. Okay, all right, sounds like a plan. So you can just do that. And look, isn't that pretty? You can that just is. like... That's like a bow tie. You could wear that yeah, on a cruise, couldn't like you? <laughs> and then you can fan it out. There, that's nice. I like that. That's lovely. I <laughs> think it was first time I've made something <laughs> like that. Really? Yeah, I like that. Right, yeah. okay. So what you can do to make it into um, a pom-pom. Where's Lucy's? Right, okay. So what you're you need to... Use you're doing this. As well. <laughs> I've got, I've, I've got uh, Nura is asking, will this live be uploaded afterwards? Yes, it will be. So we're going to put that in the resources section on YouTube and on Facebook as well. Right. So if you get your fingers in there. Fingers or thumbs? Well, whatever you want. Oh, okay. <laughs> right. And then get the scissors. I can't, well, I can't well, do no, anything now. We'll just put one in. <laughs> well, and then, and then you cut in through the cut through it. Well, what's the purpose of putting my finger in? Because you're making the hole. If you don't, you can't find the hole. <laughs> All right. And, and then, then the same the, the other side. other side. Oh, yeah, yeah. You're right, actually. It's quite hard. To... <laughs> I mean, it's strange that, isn't it? 
Say something, entertain everybody. While I... I think you are doing a really good job of that. <laughs> <laughs> Julie, we have a question from Nikki for us. Okay. Oh, you can't read it though, can you? Uh, Nikki says, sorry, just joined. Is that a black balloon inside the clear one? Yes, it is. It's one of the 16 inch um, question mark balloons. Yeah. And we've pre-stretched it before we put it in. Yeah. Yeah, and then just fluff it out. And pom-poms are great space fillers. You know, if, yeah. you, if you've got a little bit of a gap or something you want to add. That's yeah, quite I, good, I, isn't it? It doesn't look too bad. No, it's yeah. good. No, that's amazing. Okay, Fab. thanks for that. All right. So, what I'd do that. with this, I'd just probably stick this other one do, do in this? here as well. Do you want this? I'll put this down here. Yeah, with a bit of balloon bond. And then it's tying in what I've got up here. Because if I just left that there, yep. there'd be nothing to marry up with downstairs as well. So, I'm just going to stick this on. With a bit of balloon bond. And then we'll do the popping. A bit scared about the popping. Yeah, me too. <laughs> yeah, this <laughs> does not instill confidence. <laughs> but do you put something on the balloon so it doesn't <clears throat> pop, pop? Yeah, I'm going to go up the ladder again. The ladder. I'm going up. The, the IKEA step. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, I've just given away a BMCV secret. The IKEA step. <laughs> okay. Loho versus the world has said, can you give a quick recap on what you've done so far, please? Okay, I'll come down. So, I've put a 16-inch latex um, question mark lip balloon inside um, a deco bubble. I've put Lomi powder inside it. Holy. Holy. Why do I keep calling it Lomi? It's not Lomi. Lomi pedestals. Lomi, I, play, I uh, what do you call them? The, oh. the, 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 yeah, things. Yeah. Okay, holy powder. <laughs> and then I'll put it on a base um, and I've done some plaits. I've plaited up to go around either side um, and fix them together with an attachment point on the top. And now I'm just going to put a little point. So I'm going to put a little bit of stretchy balloon tape. What we're going to pop into. We've got another question, but I don't want to ask it just yet because you're, you're focusing. I'm in the moment, aren't I? Londa, I'll come back to it. Okay. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to put another piece of stretchy balloon tape on top of this. Just there like that. But I'm leaving half of the tab on. As you see my brain, my cogs are going around there. Which way around do I do this? Can you see? Yeah. So what I can do is, is when we pop it, we can then just stick that down over the hole and it makes sure ah, that so it saves the balloon clever. then so you, you're keeping the balloon. That's really good. Yeah. Right. Okay, so shall we pop it? Are we going to pop it? Do you want to pop it? You should no, pop it. No, like, no, you no, no, it. no. It's got powder and stuff and I've only got the one shirt. And <laughs> whatever. All right, okay. We're a bit nervous. Right, are we so ready? You not use a pin? Are you going to count me down? You can use a pin. I ain't oh, got hold a... On. Yeah, yeah, I mean, yeah you want something pin. quite small. This is just um, a, a tool that we use for weeding out yeah, yeah. Um, vinyl. But yeah, what I would normally do is, and, and as have well, we a, a good pin? thing. Let's do a, let's, have we got a pin? Has anybody got a pin back there? They're running around looking for pins now, everybody. Anyway, whilst, whilst we're looking for pins, which we may Can not we have, and we might have to do this, Londa has said, how does balloon bond work versus double-sided tape? So the two completely different things. No, they're not actually balloon bonds. Not it's balloon bond works in the same way as double sided tape, but it adheres really, really well to balloons. Yeah. So it's really instant. Um, and it's not really tape, is it? When you when you peel it off, you it can become a bit more like it's a, soft. A, 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 it, it's squidgy. Yeah. Yeah. It's like so if you're not careful with it, it can become a little ball or something. Yeah. I don't know how yeah, to show um, if I stick it on. It's really, really soft and. If flexible. you can't find a pin, ladies, don't don't worry. It's, I mean, I'm sure this thing's there, fine. There, you can see it's kind of like string out. I don't know yeah. if you can see. So it's not like double-sided tape. No. But the, the good thing is about this. It's like you a can, flat glue. Yeah. Isn't it really? Yeah, yeah, flat glue. That's a good way of describing it. But what you can, I mean, I, I'm sure even if you use just one piece of that and you pop it, 
it would go down very, very slowly. Yeah, it you would. could potentially even cover it up with that one piece. But I like yeah. I like your little technique there. Yeah. We can't find a pin, so let let's let's go with that. Oh, and what would be nice if you were doing this for a customer, um, it would be like to have a make a little thing like a little pin on a balloon stick and then yeah. decorate it or something. So they've got something nice to pop it with. Yeah, yeah good idea. Okay. Right. Are we ready? Are we ready? Are you going to count on, me down? Hold on, are we ready? I can't. Uh, are we ready? Let's, let's get a countdown here. Okay, okay. yeah. Right. Yeah. We, I can't see it on the screen. I can't see the thing. Can't see what? Above. Oh, which, which one do you want? You want wide or above? Well, I don't mind. I think above is good for people but to see But you need it the happening. effect from the front. Oh, yeah. Never mind. Yeah, go wide. I'm sorry. It's live. Well, it's the first time we've done it. Anyway. Okay. Hang on. I don't know if I coated it all around. Let really. me make sure it's all coated inside. <laughs> All right, we're doing a countdown. Are ready? Five, Five four, three, three two, two, one. Three. Yay! Yay! That's great. That really nice, is isn't it? really good. And then you just covered that up straight away yeah. with that. That's perfect. Yeah, and then they've still got it. You can keep it. It worked, Julie. It worked. <laughs> Way. <laughs> I bet you are relieved as That's not brilliant. powder everywhere, right? Yeah. I am very relieved. <laughs> Success. Yeah. So that's the first design. Ah, yeah, that's the first one. What are we going to do now other than right, tidy I'm up your mess? I'll tidy a little yeah. bit. Let's... Let's do, do you need these for anything? No. Okay. That was just to get you interacting. Yeah. <sighs> Kerry Ferguson. Jade, that's so cool. Oh, Kerry Ferguson gave us a, a big love heart face. Oh, God. Amazing. Thank you, Julie. That's awesome. Pioneer Europe seemed to quite like that as well. Oh, excellent. So that's, that's, that's good news. <laughs> that's good. What powder do you use inside, please? It's called... Holy powder. Holy powder. H-O-L-I. Bex, amazing with a, a heart. Thank you. Deborah thought that was great. Celebration balloons. Very impressive. I liked it. Bad. Thank you, everybody, for your comments. Lovely. Any, lovely. any other questions for Julie? Oh, we did have one question um, about stock availability. Okay. So somebody emailed about that. Yeah. And obviously, stock availability is improving. Do you know the current situation? It is It is a lot better for foils, um, for clear deco bubbles. Um, and it is it is gradually we can see. Yeah, I mean, we we see that ourselves. Yeah, so, it is. Yeah. It is, and it's just it's just been a knock on effect, and it's just keeping up with it all. But it is getting better. Yeah, yeah, we've noticed that a lot with with all Good. our suppliers. Yeah. So it's it's starting to get better, yeah. and we're starting to see consistent supply, Good. particularly for bubbles, which is fantastic. Yeah, After a couple is. of years of yeah. it being, oh, we need bubbles. Yeah, it's great to see. That. We had three pallets delivered yesterday. Wow. Yep. Good. Good. Oh. Excellent. Right, okay, so the next star design we're going to do. Michelle loves watching gender reveals. Melanie says, awesome. Hashtag Brazil. Londa says, it's a girl. It is amazing. Okay, this tape is not available in India. What can I use instead? It's from Krupalu. Or Krupalu. Do we know? There must be something I similar. I don't know. You just want like I, a, a double-sided. Is it for the stretchy balloon tip or the balloon bond? I mean, you could probably get away with either or, couldn't you? Yeah. Um, if you just need one that's got a really a strong... really strong adhesive tape of some description. So yeah. Maybe we can try and find out. Maybe we'll look into it. Nikki has said, "Wow, that was amazing. I'd be scared the balloon would pop." Um, have you ever had any pop? No. No, that's good. That's I, good. I actually haven't. Not, I guess there's always a those. risk. I mean, there, there is always that risk, but with the tape and I everything. think that's just stopping it's stopping the balloon from being shocked, isn't it, by putting that the well, stretchy remember, balloon tape I remember on as a top of kid it. when you're doing magic tricks, they just put sellotape on a latex balloon and then put a pin in it and everyone's yeah. like, wow. So it's the yeah. same sort of thing. So that should should stop it. Oh, Bex has said extra strong carpet tape. So there you go. Oh. Bex has the inside line on carpet tape, don't you, Bex? <laughs> Oh, I, there's lots of comments. I'm going to go back up. Okay. That's amazing. Okay. Do you supply the powder? We do not sell the powder, but we'll have to have a look at buying that powder in. So thank you. I don't think we sell it. We might sell it. Do we sell it? 
No. Well, Lucy says we don't sell it, it, so we will get it in at Balloon Market. So thank you. Um, can always personalize it with a question mark or boy or girl if you want yeah. to. Did you stick the pin in the balloon tape when popping to conceal the powder? Yes. Yes. Um, is that sticky bonding? The people highly recommend, but yeah, I found it not to stick well. Okay. Um, it's if you're doing something wrong, it could be. I know it, it helps when you heat it up, doesn't it? So you put your finger on it. And, yeah, and just like the same with yeah. tape as well. So I tend to, if I know I'm going to be using some tape and I'm going to be using it in a cold environment, I'll cut the piece and then I'll just put it in my back pocket yeah, and just yeah. like, and then it, it just warms it up. Yeah. So it, it it could be that, Tracy. Extra some carpet tape, as Beck said. Used to balloons and balloon market. Well, hello, Diane. Nice to have you here um channel has been an invaluable resource thank you you're very welcome thank you for watching it's such a different way of normal gender reveals definitely going to incorporate this into our services uh daniel in australia wow what time is it in australia what time is it in australia daniel is it 12 hours depends where you are i guess but it's it's middle of the night probably what's the powder called holy powder h-o-l-i um hey, I, it's holy powder, yeah. <laughs> That's it. So we had a, a rush ah, of comments there. Thank excellent. you, everybody, for those. Good. All right. So I'm going to make this little character. Now, I, I really wanted to do it with this because this is my favorite balloon. And you're probably going to think I'm a little bit bonkers for saying this. But when we were in lockdown and we were all stuck in our house all the time, I had one of these inflated sat on my desk because it made me smile. All oh, right. Because okay. it's really cute, isn't it? I mean, that doesn't make me think you're bonkers. But... <laughs> <laughs> But many other things do. <laughs> <Indeed>. I don't know. <laughs> right. Okay. So hold on. Hold on. Oh. Londa says Balloon Market is one of my favorite channels. Thanks, Londa. Um, it's seven forty-five p.m. in Australia. Where are you in Australia, Daniel? That's that's earlier than I thought. I thought it'd be much much later. Where do we guess? Where do we guess Daniel is? Which side of the country? I was in the middle of the country. Perth. Let's say Perth. No Sydney, no Perth. I don't know. <laughs> no Sydney. <laughs> can I use sellotape? Um, you probably can. Yeah, I'll probably put a couple of, of pieces. Um, yeah, because to. it's just about sealing that. But then you've just got to seal a hole afterwards. But sellotape well. can be quite brittle, can't it? It can be. Know. Yeah, scotch tape that might work. Yeah, scotch tape is yeah For because that's a America, similar sort tape. of. Yeah. Um, consistency to balloon bond, isn't it? A little yeah. bit. I see what you mean about sellotape. It could be a bit. Quite yeah, not not. Brittle, I think if you tear but, it, it, yeah. Do you know yeah, what I mean? It's, okay. it's... Perth. Daniel's in Perth. Perth. It says Perth, Gary. I don't know who Gary is. <laughs> but that's all right, <laughs> um, it's six forty-seven a.m. in Alabama. What are you doing up at wow. that ridiculous time, Londa? Oh, Bustleton, two and a half hours south. Of Perth. We're learning all sorts of things. You are, right? Yeah. yeah. Are we going to crack on? Yeah, sorry, carry on. So, I'm just um, tying this with the 260 just so as I can get it ready to attach to my bubble. So, the bit I've already made the base, but I'm going to show you how I made the base. So, I really like the base because it's quite cute. It's kind of like got its little booties. With little bows on. Yeah, um, I've got a little sand weight in there. I've, sand's better because it's nice and you can squish it down yeah. so it's nice and flat and it doesn't make it wobble about a little bit. So we've fed the booties using um, a little distortion technique. So I'll show Ooh. you how we do this. Okay, so I'm going to pre stretch. Oh, yeah, they're, they're different. Oh, yeah, they're... oh, yeah, they're... oh that's quite cool. It's just a little yeah. different shape, isn't it? And then I'm going to tear, I'm going to cut a bit off this to 160. Oh, <laughs> that was a bit dangerous, wasn't it? All right, so I'm going to put it in half and I'm going to poke it inside my balloon like this. Yep. Yeah. And then I'm going to pump up the five inch balloon. And then using my pocket pump, I'm going to go into the open end of the 160. Nice to get it in as well. So. Yeah. And then I'm going to do seven pumps. 
and I've worked out seven because that's the right size for what I want. So you just it just takes a little bit of playing around yeah, with it and yeah. working out how many pumps you need. And then all you need to do is you need to pull the ends of your 260 up as far as 160. Oh yeah, 160, thanks. Of your 160 up so it won't go any further. And then tie a knot in it. I just say it's a 160 Q as well. It's a 160 Q. Don't forget the Q. I know. In trouble. <laughs> Trouble. Right, and I can snip that off thing. All right. That's a really cool shape. I like that. Oh. It's gone down. <laughs> I'm not quite finished. <laughs> well, that's right. It's a clown okay. foot, isn't it? It's, yeah, it's yeah. a clown foot. It yeah, is. Love it. But this is how you can make flowers yeah. as well. Flower of course, petals. Yeah, that's a nice petal. Yeah. So you can just reshape see, you see it. see things like that and you think it's really hard to do. Yeah, but, but it's not. That's, that's it's just practicing the technique. And then I just tie in a knot in that. And you can have it as puffed up yeah. or as flat as you want. And we'll just like manipulate that to get it to whatever roundness you want it. That's quite a satisfying shape. It's like a pebble or something. Yeah, it's a it? bit it's like a, a pedal. Skimmy one. Yeah, yeah. it is. Yeah. And you can do it. You can, so you can maneuver. If you didn't want to use it, I want that there because I want to use it as an attachment. But you can maneuver it around. Yeah. yeah. So that it's it's there and then you can make it you can use it in different ways sue bowler showed us that when she did mushrooms oh, yes. <laughs> she, did mushroom. she didn't do mushrooms <laughs> but when she made mushrooms out of balloons um, <laughs> and it was um i was really amazed and she did a caterpillar with it as well it was brilliant yeah. absolutely brilliant right i'm gonna get another 160 now and just show you um how I made the bow. Now, there's loads of different ways of making bows, and depending on how big I'm doing the bow, I'll maybe use a different technique, but because I want this to be quite small, I want to do it in little stages. Mm -hmm. So just a little tip as well, when you're doing, when you're pulling one sixes and two sixty cues, if you struggle to tie them, just pull them on a little bit further and it gives you a longer neck to tie it with. Like oh, that. good idea. Okay, so oh, that was going to fall off then. Just let a little bit of air out just to soften it. It's great having a bigger table. Yeah, it's Stuff good, isn't it? doesn't fall off. And we're not fighting, are we? I know. We're not know. fighting for the space. Not yet. You can't see it either, but there's storage shelves under here. It's tidy. All in sorts it. of. Well. <laughs> There's, there's, there's stuff there. Oh, is. let me check my phone and see if anybody sent any more um, questions by email. Okay, shall I? You carry on. You carry on. Do you oh. want to do this on the overhead? Okay, so I'm just going to make a little bubble to start with, about an inch, and then I'm going to hold on nope. to that, and then I'm going to do um, a loop like this and then I'm going to twist that and then I'm going to do another little loop and I'm just squeezing it as I'm going along to push the air and that stops your balloon from popping and I'm going to do another little loop like this and give it a twist and then I'm going to make a little bubble so I want to make like the little Kerry's been on it and as she said you can buy a balloon bond in India Oh. One of the distributors. Oh, she's B bad, isn't she? BDC she's in India. So if you're in India and you want balloon bond, head over to BDC. Real. Okay. So I'm just going to do like a little bubble and then I'm going to do pinch twist with it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick up that bubble with my fingers, pull it in and twist it. Oh, nice. Now, I'm going to do... If I was doing this on a design, um, if I wanted it to be on something that it's not going to be sat flat against, I'd do another little bubble at that back side. But yeah. because I want it to sit flat on it, um, I'm just going to do it because that stops it from like Excuse moving please. back like that. <coughs> oh, Excuse me. It's a good job I moved oh. that low my powder out of the way. So you would normally edit that out as well. <laughs> And then I'm just going to finish it off by measuring. So I've got the tails the same. Give it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to make another little bubble there and twist it off there while holding on to that because then I can reuse this balloon. Indeed. 
don't lose it. I've lost it though. But it's fine because I can pump back into it. There we go. Oh, thank you, Maz. Maz said bless, bless you. you. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think I said bless you, did I? That's a bit rude and I'm stood next to you. That's fine. Right. I'm not offended. And then you can just stick that on there like that. Lovely. So, How would you stick that on just with some balloon bond? Balloon bond. There we are. Balloon bond. Okay, yeah. very good. Okay, so this is how I've made that. So this is one pump, a four balloon cluster, one pump. These are one pump as well. And these I've just I've just blown them up. I've done seven um, pumps for the balloon inside and then just let them down. And then just a little sand wear. Yeah. All right. So... I've, I've air filled this bubble and I'm just going to pull it into the base. So that's not a deco bubble? No, this is a bubble. This is a bubble bubble. A, yes, it's a bubble bubble. Bubble a print, with a valve. A printed bubble printed with a valve. Bubble. A 22 it's, it's inch. 22 inch. Thank you, Debs. Have we got these in stock? I'm guessing we have. Yeah. Yeah. Very nice. Right. So I could have done this before, actually, because I've already shown you the attachment technique. But I'm going to do an attachment point on top again. It's not going to sit straight yet. It's not sitting straight. Well, it will do eventually. Okay. Have All right. patience. All right. Right. I just need a little bit. The 260Q. Mm -hmm. So when you're doing this, you just need to try and find the middle point. A lot of people, um, when I've been speaking to them, they've been, they've, they'll use like um, glue dots or something like that to attach like a foil balloon or mm, something mm. like that. And that's fine if it's an embellishment, mm. but if it's kind of structural, if it's part of the main design, you, you need, need a bit more security, Yeah, you do, you? definitely. Yeah. Oh, you got a mention there, Alex. Loving the graphics coming into the screen from Londa. <laughs> Alex says thank you, Londa. It's all Alex. He's behind the scenes. He's Alex doing all of that. Awesome. We'll bring him on 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 camera in a minute. Yeah, come on, whenever you like, Alex. Just pop your head in and say hello. Come on, oh, he's come coming. On he's now. coming. Yay! Come on. Alex, you're going to meet Alex. This is the, the the person behind the camera on BMTV, and he's the guy that does all the <laughs> editing and all of that. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> hey, do you want to take center stage? There Yay! you go. This is Alex, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> This is this is what it's like always for you guys. This is yeah. what it's like. This is terrifying. It's good. Yeah. Isn't it? you do this. <laughs> we don't really. We, we make it up as we go along. <laughs> Hello, everyone. It could all be going horribly wrong now because There's Alex no is here and, and nobody's there. <laughs> oh, Debs and Lucy <laughs> are interfering. In <laughs> if we go offline, I do apologise. You're both doing a great job. Thank you, you really Alex. Thank, Thank you. you. You're doing a good job too. You are. You're doing an amazing <laughs> job. Londa says you're awesome. You've got a fan. He's a cool dude as well. He's a cool dude. Right, okay. So then I'm just going to attach a little cluster. This is just one pump. And then I can pull <laughs> then the smiley face. Michelle said we can't see your face, Alex. You're going to have to come back. We'll go wide. Jade said you're doing an awesome job as well. Oh, you've got fans. I don't think we should let Alex back in front no, of the, I don't. the camera. We can't share it, can he's, we? He's coming anyway. <laughs> he's coming again. Okay. This is, you'll see his face now. Oh, it's a bit like the stick. We shouldn't show his face. Yeah. Should we? <laughs> I was, was going to hide behind it. Hello, it's my face. <laughs> there you go, Michelle. Hope that's okay. 
Right, okay, so I need some arms. Now, I've pre-made the arms, but You're I will sure show you how to do it. Yeah, it'll be fine. Okay. It's just because I've just worn too many bonkers. All right, like you last night, eh? I didn't, no, didn't I was you? the good girl. Okay. Right, let's put him over there for a minute while I show you how to do the arms. Oh, Londa, now that's worth getting up at daylight for. <laughs> <laughs> right, I'm going to make an arm now. Greetings from Party Deco Mega Store um, in Germany. Ooh. Hello. Right, okay, so for this little cuff bit here, I'm just. I've not been paying any attention. Oh, no, you I'm sorry. No, I hope fine. everybody else has. Uh, <laughs> go on, do it's what you're fine. doing. Mm. Okay, so I'm just going to do a little loop. And then I'm going to put my thumb on the knot there and then twist it. And then I'm going to get the knot, the neck, and then I'm just going to pull it through and that just stops it from coming undone. It locks okay. it in. And then I'm going to separate them like this, push it down, and I'm going to pinch in the middle and twist. That's like a little bit. Very nice. And then I'll just do a little... I like that you've got your little gift bag with all your stuff in it you need. It looks better than having a mess all just over, like a, isn't it? A mess or a, just yeah. a, a plastic bag. That's quite nice. And these are part of the style party wearing. And where can you get those? You can get them from Balloon Market. You can. <laughs> <laughs> so to attach this in, I've this tied it QVC, off. This is a QVC, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it is. Should, we should have a countdown. <laughs> like, I don't know. I never watch QVC. I don't know what goes you on do, there. You do, don't you? I don't. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen countdowns. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so I'm just going to literally wrap that round there. Oh, Diane's asked the question, how much would you charge for this? And how long normally would it take? Okay. So or how long would it take for the whole thing? Let's, let's start with that. It depends on how many times you've done it because you, you've got to practice it to work out what you're doing. And then, but I reckon you could probably do that. And if you knew what you were doing, <laughs> okay. you could probably do it in about 20 minutes-ish. Oh. Yeah, do you say, Lucy, yeah, about 20 okay. minutes. And job costing, I'd job cost it. I'd always do a job cost for anything. Yeah, um, yeah. absolutely. So everybody always says that. And I know. What do you think you should charge for that? Yeah, Leave good. your comments. That's really good. That'll be interesting. And if you do, if you're not good at job costing, like I, I'm not, you can use our interactive pricing tool from the Balloon Market website. Just head over and I don't know where it is. It's on there somewhere. I think I think we've actually got a, a banner that says interactive pricing. It's in resources. That's where it is. It's in the resources section on balloonmarket.co.uk. But yeah, what do you what do you all think you should charge? What do you think you would charge for that, Diane? Bearing in mind it's going to take you 20 minutes. You can see what's a, what, what you need. What would you charge? Right. So for the elbows, all I do is do like a little bubble. And then do a pinch twist. And then that just gives you like an, an angle. So yeah. it's really good for if you're doing knees or elbows or things like that. George, I think that, that's how you pronounce that. I apologize if it's not. It says 39 euros for something like that. I had, I had I a figure know. in my head. I'm going to wait. A few more people. Put, put okay. a, few, put a few, right. more, few more prices. Let's see what everybody else thinks. Okay. And then what I would do is I'd just finish it off. And it says 36 pounds. I think that's the fair. I think that's about. Oh, I, want, I want a few more. Don't, don't, don't. Oh, okay. Well, I don't know because I haven't job costed it anyway. Okay. But I right. probably should have done. I do understand when people ask that question. I know it can be frustrating and it can be, you know, let's yeah. let's job cost it properly and everything. But there is an overall feel of value. Yeah, I there think. is. Yeah. And you know, if you were to say 150 quid for that, that's yeah, that's ridiculous. If you were to say nine pounds that also that, is yeah, ridiculous is. so i think there is an overall sort of We've, price that, that you you feel it's worth but you've got to you've got to cost it out to work out how much it's going to cost you first yeah, absolutely because if the perceived value of it is less than what it's actually is more than it's not commercial yeah, yeah exactly yeah, yeah. Uh, so yeah. you've got to work it out yeah you've absolutely got to do yeah. your pricing properly okay 45 pounds linda says Daniel, 65 to 75 Australian dollars. Um, Jade, 40 US dollars. 
Very we good. Aren't, we haven't finished yet, though. I know, I know, okay. Because there's something else that I'm going to do. We're not talking delivery, London. No, we're just talking about the, the virus. Right. We're going to so, do something else. This so. is a little bit wobbly because the weight that I've put in it is a little bit too big. And okay. it's safe that. So just if you've got it and the weight's nice and the right size, a little bit smaller, then it will fit okay. better. Right. right, so what I want to do is I want to make it... Um, I really like this world balloon. Yeah. So we're going to we've put um, welcome to the world, Alface. So what we want to do is we want to have the little character ah. holding the balloon. So if I put that, I'm just going to, I've done it on Tenile Online because what, balloons always need to be weighted. Whatever, yeah. even if you're tying them into designs, you still need it to be weighted. So I'm just going to pop it round the latex so it looks like he's holding it. And then I've got I've put it on a little clip weight, and that will just sit comfortably. You can just clip that in the back. Okay, I'll just, just hook it round. And then what you can do is that can be um, if it was like for a, a child who's um, if obviously for a baby, if it was going to be for uh, <laughs> that'd be a good thing. Um, if it was for say like if you've already got a child and. The and the, the new baby comes along. You could give this to the baby, and, and you then, could put have this saying like little sister or little yeah, brother yeah, or something, yeah. and then that can be taken away and given to the because it's always awkward when you have a second child, isn't it? Because you don't want them to feel left out. Yeah, absolutely. So we've got a, a few more um, prices. Yeah, definitely fifty dollars. What about if with this other balloon added? What do you think that would be now? How much more added value is there there? So Michelle, 37 to 45 pounds, very good. Is that for the additional balloon as well, Michelle? I quite like this. I quite like people telling us. Good, I'm glad. I, I, I've got an idea in my head, and I, I probably shouldn't say, but... Yeah, do a job cost list. Oh, Lucy's on a job cost form. She's doing it She's right now, it. live. <laughs> um, oh, Linda last, uh, would add at least another 25 pounds for that extra balloon. Oh. Just takes it up Helium's to expensive, isn't it? Yeah, 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 35, 40, 50, 60 pounds, something like that. Okay, thanks, Michelle. Because I thought, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to reveal my answer now. Okay. I thought that that on its own was about 35 pounds. Yeah. Is, is my, my gut. Yeah. Um, with that, that probably takes it up to 50 pounds, I would have thought. Yeah. That's, that's how I feel. Um, and I think if you sold it as two in one, if you did do that as a little brother or a little sister one, it's like two in one, so it's two gifts for the price yeah. of the one, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, exactly, exactly. Yeah. So, but let's let's find out. Job costing. Who's doing it? You're doing it. Lucy. Right. Okay. We'll Just come, cranking up a computer and all We'll that, come so. back to that because I want you to do something now, Greg. Tina says, no, she thinks it's 46 pounds with both. Elma says, beautiful decoration. Daniel says, with our helium price, I'd turn it into a hundred Australian dollars. Yep, helium is very expensive at the moment. Where are you going? Are you going? I'm tidying you know, up. Okay. <laughs> Coming up, encroaching on your. What time, time is it? How long have we been going? Oh, we said we were going to have a break at an hour. What, what are we at? Over an hour. We're not over an yeah, hour. We're over an hour. Yeah. Can we just do something first before we swap? Right. While Lucy's doing the job cost. Okay, yes, do right. something first. So, can you remember when I came on last time and before we went on and you were saying, oh, this is good, Julie, you've got all your things personalised. Yes, yeah. And then as soon as we started recording, you said, oh, Julie wants me to tell you about her stuff that's all personalised, taking the mick out of me. Yeah. I, I don't remember that, but I'll say yes, I remember it. Okay, what's this? Oh, look at that. I've got a Greg pump. But you've got to use it. Okay. Okay, right. so we're going to... This, this camera oh, cam here. Sorry. Yes. So it's Greg. Look. So... In a blue bag. We're going to make a balloon dog. Oh, no. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Can you do that? Can you do that? Huh? <laughs> Shall we try? Do what? Oh. Do what? No, I'm still... <laughs> anyway, okay. I'll practice balloon dogs. that for next time. All right. I wanted some crumb balloons actually, but I haven't brought any. Let me have a look. Okay, we'll just we'll just hang out. I'm sorry. Oh, look, we've got some here. We can use these. Julie's hands. found some two sixty Qs, everybody. 
Do you want to go blue or pink? I want to go blue. Okay. I don't know why I said that so enthusiastically. Because <laughs> you're excited, aren't you? Okay. Right, okay. So we're going to do three pumps. I can't pump it up. Okay. And then tie a knot. Well, this is the hard part, Julie. Well, you you should have listened and left a long note, which you have. So that's all right. I Just got tie big fat fingers. Big fat fingers. This, this is why I don't do it, Julie. <laughs> Seriously. Look, just go, just go like that. Oh, you just, uh, and just. We're editing this out. You just, you can't edit it. It's like, yeah, do, you do, do you want me to tie it up? Okay. I'll, I'll go pink. Okay. Yeah. Right. Where's my mouse gone? Oh, there it is. Okay. Right, are you ready? What am I doing? We're going to make a balloon dog. So we need to make a bubble to start with about three fingers width. Okay. Now, once you start twisting, you've got to make sure you're always twisting, twisting the same in way. the same I know, direction. I know, I know. I'll do this in Have you been like practicing this at home? No, 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 not at all. Okay, and then just keep giving it a little gentle squeeze to push the air across. Okay. It'll go too tight. Right, so you need to keep hold of that. And then we're going to make another bubble and we're going to do it a little bit bigger, just a little bit bigger than that. I don't know if I've done that the right way or not. <laughs> I think I've done it the wrong way. Hold on. I don't know which way I did it. Well, it's all right because we're going to be locking it in in yeah, there anyway. All right. And then I want you to fold it over like this. Okay. Squeeze. Yeah. And then pinch. Yeah. And then twist. Hey, I've got a dog. Fab. Right, so you've got a nose and you've got ears. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> not quite. You're not doing bad, though. I'm quite impressed. All right, so give it a little squeeze. Squeeze, squeeze. Right, so we're going to give it a neck. So I think the neck's probably about three fingers width again. Okay. Oh, it's a big neck. That's all right. Yeah. And then we're going to do the same thing as we did do for the ears, but we're going to do a little bit longer. We want probably like four fingers width oh, so for the legs. Okay, all right. So do one, then go back on yourself again. Give it a squeeze. I think I'm getting, I'm getting it all messed up. No, you're not. That's right. No, I'm, I'm twisting it the wrong way. Uh, okay. All right. Oh, I'm not doing that. No, 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 I'll you need another, another bubble. All right. Oh, no, you just need to fold it onto it, look, like that. So fold. Oh, okay. Like that. Yeah, yeah, got it, got it, got it, got it. Yeah, and then pinch it and twist it. I'm really oh, impressed. Oh, legs are upside down. There we go. That's all right. Okay. So, okay. so then we need the body. So I usually do about the width of my hand, okay. which might be a little bit different for us, because we'll fine. give it a whirl. All right. And then hold on to that yeah, yeah. again, and then we're going to do the legs. So about the same length as you oh, did got, the ones before. I've got it, I've before. got it, I've got it, I've got it, I've got it. <laughs> I'm flying. And it's got slightly longer legs. Have you beat me? You've beat me! Hey! How'd you do that? I'm not going to put my mouth on it. No, I'm, I'm not. I don't well, like you it. You can do that. You can, can do that. But I quite like oh. it without, <laughs> don't you? You can tell. <laughs> Very good. Well done. Very good. I think that's good. Yeah. I'm impressed. They're so nice in chrome, aren't they? They're yeah. like those. Who's the, what's the artist guy that did the big dogs? What, what, what's his name? Jeff Coons. Yes. He did the. Did uh, he? You're not saying it's sold for millions and millions of did pounds. The big, the big Jeff Coons. But yeah, recommend it. Yeah, they Have do. Look. They look quite luxurious. They, these are nice to just add into little designs as a little bit. Oh, Greg is twisting the animal instead of the spare balloon. Sorry, uh, Wanda. That's why I don't do this. Yeah, but look, he's got a result. Oh, no. yeah. It doesn't matter how it. you do it, as long as you get the result. And what you could do with this, you could just twist that off and then just make it a you little. I mean, but I, th I think that's impressive. That's not bad, is it? No, it's good. Anyway. So, it stands up and everything, look. Yeah, man doesn't stand up. Skills. It deserves Anyway, what are we going to do now? Right. Oh, is that it? Are we going to have a break? Um, yeah. Okay, we're going to have a break, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, Diane. What's his name? What, the balloon's name? I don't know. What should we call Oh, what's his name? I see. I thought you meant the dog's name. Okay, Jeff Coons. Yeah, he's the um, 
the artist. Anyway, we're going to come back for that. Have you got a price yet or not? Okay, we're after this break, we will give you the work type price. All right, have fun. We'll be back in a few minutes. See you Bye. In a bit. Bye.
I'll be picking my nose or something. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> Are we live? We're live. Hello again, everybody. Okay, slightly longer than five minutes. I do apologize. But we do have a prize for you, don't we, Lucy? 
We do, yeah. So we did the calculation, or Lucy did the calculation on her laptop in a very strange way. The laptop screen was flat on the floor. And anyway, it was very <laughs> odd. Um, and you came up with the, the whole design mm -hmm. was cheaper than you thought it was going to be, wasn't yes. it? So what did it come out as? It came out at uh, £36 something. So the selling price, if you rounded it up a little bit more, we, we said £44.99, didn't we? £49.99. Yeah. £49.99 is what you got, which is pretty close to what I said, yeah. to be fair. £50. Pounds, so. Mm -hmm. um, so, but of course, it does depend on your market. It depends on, on your audience yeah. and how long it takes you as well. You've got to consider that. So if you're new and it takes you 45 minutes, yeah. you want to charge a bit more than if you've been doing it a while and it takes you 20. Anyway, mm -hmm. Lucy, we're live. We are. Oh, thank God Julie's gone, eh? Um, <laughs> right. Yeah, so, <laughs> so um, Lucy is just as messy as Julie. In fact, I'd, I'd say you're probably a little bit more messy, so I'll be very busy picking up after you. So. Anyway, you've, you've, you've got a circle there. What, okay. what, what are we going to do? Okay, so we're going to do, um, we're looking at hanging designs. Okay. Yeah? All air filled. Okay. Um, using a 60 centimeter. Oh, well, you know what I didn't do? Mm -hmm. I know you've been on BMTV before, but yeah. nobody's seen you being on oh, no, 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 BMTV. It's quite hard to say. <laughs> Beyond BMTV. So, yes, we've done some filming with Lucy already. But those shows just haven't gone out yet. So this is really Lucy's first time on BMTV, and it's a BMTV live. So anyway, sorry, carry on. I interrupted. Right. <laughs> okay, so sixty centimeter hoop, and we're going to use in some raffia. Okay. Mich Michelle said hi, Lucy. Hello. <laughs> um, so this is the um, long raffia from the website. Yeah, hold on. Sorry, I'm just trying to. Yeah, go on. So this is. Yeah, we sell this, do we? You do. Wow. Straight from the shop floor yesterday. Okay, so I'm just going to take a little bit. And I want some long pieces. Okay. So this goes a long way for what we're going to do. Okay. Excellent. Okay. So I've just put um, some 160s onto the, the hoop. Huge. Over the yeah, 160 cubes, okay. yeah, <laughs> onto the hoop. <laughs> and then uh, I'm just going to tie it on. Okay. And I'm using 160s purely because they were there. But I want it, it, I've gone for diamond clear because you don't want to see it. Yeah. So just tie it off in a permanent. Don't to hold it. Yeah, you can do. Thank you. And then we're just going to wrap it around now. So we're going to cover. Cover it around. You just rotate it. Yeah, just for a, what the hoop? Yeah. Could do, I suppose. <laughs> I've seen this before. This is a really nice rustic feel. It is, yeah, especially with the colours that are quite on trend at the moment as well. Just hit me in the face. Where's it? Okay. <laughs> Where can the hoop be purchased? Oh, do we sell these hoops as well? Yeah, yeah. This one's got from. Oh, we sell these here. At Blue Market? Yeah. Okay, back UK. I didn't realise that. Lucy, can we take really your mic again? Can you check your microphone? Is it oh, on? It's, it is on. It yeah, is on. So on. It. Okay. Do you, should we swap mics? Mike? Lucy's Lucy's mic is not working. We can swap mics if you want to. Um, yeah, we can we can see how that goes. Hi, Jacqueline. Let me just turn it off and on again. Oh, Alex is doing something very technical with the mics. He's turning yeah. them off and on again. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Keep, talk, keep talking. Hello, yes, hello. Yeah. I'm not a pheasant plucker. I'm a pheasant plucker, Sam. I'm only plucking pheasants and the pheasant plucker comes. <laughs> yes. you do. So, no, yeah. so you don't. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it would definitely uh -huh. be expletive. Like. Under the bumper said, can't hear Lucy. Hello, you all right? Let's swap mics. Yeah, let's. I'm We're going to swap mics, everybody. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to mute everyone. It's live. Just briefly. And then we'll be right back with you. That is the mic. So, Lucy, you're wearing the wrong mic. No, she was wearing the one that she had on already. Well, that's that's the one. That's probably why. Rhonda says, get Alex to come and fix it. Rhonda <laughs> 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 likes Alex. Thank you. Are we, are we back on? Yeah. Now we can, we can end up. Lovely. Lucy was wearing the wrong mic. So the mic was over there instead of on Lucy. Anyway, we're back. Thank you, everybody, for saying that. Thank you. Um, 
Okay, so I've just, with this design, I've gone sort of asymmetrical, so like a crescent, crescent yep. moon, so I'm not going all the way around. I'm leaving these bits on, and then, I'll tell you what, Greg, do you want to pass them over, please? Yes. Thank you. So we're using um, ivory silk, five inch, five inch blush, five, uh, seven inch chrome copper, and seven inch chrome rose gold as well. You just wanted to get these out in your Yeah, album. please. So we're doing... Um, Clusters of threes and fours, organic style. So when you inflate the balloon, just make sure it's nice and rounded. Let me just show you one. So inflate it, push it down to get it nice and round. There's twos as well. Yeah, you can get the twos out as well. So push it down nice and tight, and then we're just going to wrap it around and tie off the little duplex. And we're, because we're going organic, we want the size of slightly. And very, so I'm gonna go a little bit smaller. I it's a static, it's making my nails really. <laughs> Probably all that raffia. Okay, so with our hoops, we're just gonna attach them on. So just attach them on, just one around the other, yeah. just to lock it in place. And we're just gonna go quite random with these. So we've got threes, I might add in the flush of four. Yeah. Oh, it's gone down there. Just go. The knife has gone down the t-shirt. <laughs> 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 is that on? Oh, you've got it in the wrong way. Sorry, everybody. There you go. This is carry on now. Right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So we just so anyway, attach so them. What are we doing? We're so we on just, our microphone. Can everybody yeah. hear us? Yeah. Okay. So we're just attaching the clusters on. So freeze fours. And we're just going to mix the uh, colour combination up as well. So this one's slightly bigger, so I'm just going to put it further down. Okay. You're literally just twisting them. Yeah, just twist them on. Yeah, they need to be on because they need to be locked, locked into position. And just make sure if you've got the colours all in one side, just twist them around. Yep. Okay, we'll go. Oh, no, God, leaf again. I know, it's it everywhere. gets everywhere. It does, it does. Do you want to help? No. Nope. No? Okay, don't. Okay. <laughs> That's Excuse why me, I... Really I'm, made me help. Yeah. I, I, I'm not sure I could help. I, I, Go on. So put them on, that's it, and twist one balloon Mix around the other one, so they're locking onto the, that's it, and then push it in, push it up a little bit. You just twist it once, twist that's it twice. That's it, once is fine, yeah, and that'll do. All right. All right, so I'm just mixing this up a little bit more. Jade's saying bloopers, somebody's saying the volume is not working. Is it working now? Can you hear us okay? All right. <laughs> Turn on. Yeah. Okay. I'm not saying anything interesting. <laughs> no, you are. As long so, as everybody can hear you. That's all right. Your mic. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so if this was a different colour design, so if you went black, you could you'd wrap the, the hoop first with a 260. Yeah. Because they're, they're quite muted colours. No, oh, it's nothing that's a you glue. We're gonna take that one off. That can go. I'll just leave that one in. I can just pass the smell ones, please. Thank you. Just make sure. This one is asking. Yes, chrome copper. This one's oh, chrome right, copper. I've got to ask the question. Oh, sorry. Maybe just because you can read it. <laughs> I can see it. <laughs> Hi there. Sorry, was it chrome copper? Yes, it is it chrome is. copper. It is. It's a lovely colour, chrome okay. copper. Really nice. I miss what you're saying, what Tony's saying, what colours are it? So we've got chrome copper, which is that one. Yeah, we've got chrome rose gold. Chrome rose gold. That one. Uh, blush. Blush. And ivory silk. Ivory silk. <laughs> So we're just filling in the gaps and gold flakes and hair and everything else. Raffia. Okay, so I'm just going to bring it up. Oh, it's, it's, it's Carol's end, the volume. So I'm all ah, right. Auntie Dokey. <laughs> so just making sure we've got a mixture of colour going on. Got no gaps. 
Okay. Okay. So these these little bits here, you can either cut them off. Or I'm going to leave them because I quite like them rustic looking. Okay. Very wurzel gummage. It is. It is. It's another. If, another if, roll if, if, with if one. Just look it up. They they re-released it, I didn't know, they? they did, yeah, they? my kids watched it. Right. Okay. The original was a bit odd, though, wasn't it? I used to like was a gummage. Yeah, yeah, I did. Okay. So we're going to take some more raffia, and just to add some visual texture into the design. Okay. So when you're creating, you want to add texture because it adds um, movement and balance to the design. So just little sections. Yep. Okay. And then all we're going to do is just wrap them around the blue. Okay. So if you want to do some as well. Oh, you want me to? to, to yeah. Do some please. Too. So just wrap them around. You could um, 260 queue them in if you needed to. And I didn't sign up for this, but. No, whatever. I see it. Well, it's gone everywhere, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, you yeah. Oh, you, look, it's everywhere. <laughs> Trying to keep the studio tidy. And then I come in. <laughs> and then it's just too long. I mean, oh, bless you. Yeah. Oh, no, I've got the scissors. That's it. And if it's obviously oh, too long, we just cut them down. Oh, give, why's my nose so itchy? Give them a trim. That's it, Manny, when he get an itchy nose. Oh, is it? No, well, it's I'm going to get them. some or I'm going to lose some. Possibly. One of the two. <laughs> that doesn't help. <laughs> right. Okay. All right. Yeah. So, again, you could use this for sort of Harvest Festival as well. I've got a couple um, of questions. Yeah, sure. Oh, so actually, that well, you read question. it. Oh, okay. What decor purpose market is this piece ah. used mostly? So, okay. as you were just saying. Yeah, but again, these colours are very on trend for um birthdays for some gender reveals in the past i've done like big hoops of these yeah, yeah. um tony has asked are they all five inch balloons but of course chrome are seven, seven inch. yeah five mm -hmm. and seven inch yeah definitely okay so on here i've left my 160 and we're going to fill this hole so this looks okay as it is now yep okay but we're just going to fill it with um a 20 inch deco bubble okay, okay so i get rid of that hey that's the question question of the week no, I've not got a question for week, but uh, I had this conversation with my daughter the other day. Are you an okie dokie person or are you an okie doke person? An okie doke. Do you say okie doke or do you say okie dokie? Okie dokie. Okie dokie. Yeah. Yeah, I'm an okie dokie. Okay. Person. Sometimes okay. I say okie doke though. No, I heard of that one. What, what is it? <laughs> what, 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 Julie, what are you? Are you an okie dokie or an okie dokie? Okie dokie. Alex? Okie dokie. Okay. Is there anybody that's not okie dokie? Am I just making something random up? Okie doke. My daughter says okie doke. Anyway, leave comments <laughs> down below. Okay. Okie doke. Yeah. Okie dokie is Maz. Thank you. Right. Anyway, sorry, I, I got That's totally right. off track there. <laughs> okay, so we've got a 20 inch deco. Yep. A 16 inch blush. Yep. And it's going to pre stretch it. So it's going to put it onto the machine, stretch it. <laughs> size is that it's a 16 That's massive. it is they go i've gone past where you'd normally go Ooh. okay and then take the 20 inch bubble hopefully there's not many packets in here if you count <laughs> just the one just the one okay and then at this point we just need a funnel so see one have you got a funnel no i'd left uh yeah i'll use this one mm, maybe not that we've got another funnel, funnel there? runners Absolutely. Funnel and a funnel. straw, play and a straw, please. Yep, yeah, lovely, perfect. It's great having runners. It is. I really like it this. is. Thank you. Cheers. Okay, so we're going to take the sixteen. We're going to fold and roll it up. I'm just going to move this out. Yeah, the way sure. Temporarily. So fold and roll it. Okay, but before I do that, I'm just going to leave that there. Oh we're no, gonna, getting messy. We are. This is what we're all covered with, isn't it? Oh dear. Okay, so. Taking a funnel, gonna put it into the the bubble. I still got some of the pink stuff in there. Do you want to? That do? No, it's all right. It might add to it. Because we can use one of the um, the wipes, or the, the wet wipe things. Okay, so we're just gonna push it in, and we've been using this a lot the last couple of months, and I really, really do like it. I'll put a bit more in. I've got it in three colours, I think. Yes. Gold, rose gold, and I think silver. Yeah, I really like the rose gold. I really do. That the rose gold would work with this as well. I was gonna say, why do you not use the rose gold? I don't know. 
I had, I had gold. <laughs> All right. Yeah, it's got a bit more. And there's so much you can do with it. At the moment, where I'm putting it inside a balloon, but you can use it on the outside of the balloon, which I'm going to show you oh, later yeah. on. Are you? Time. Oh, yeah, this That's time. Quite yeah. All the time, all day. That's it. Right. <laughs> Okay, so that's going to go in. I'm just going to push it around a little bit. It's all got stuck. Could okay. you have inflated that a little bit? You could have done, yeah. But I'm trying not to get too much air in. Okay. So it's going to take the 16, roll it up. Some people use a straw as well to put this with. Yeah. But I'm just going to rub it. The glasses on. Put your frame. And just pull it through. So make sure the bead of the 16 is mm -hmm. on the neck of the at the end of the bubble. Okay. So right at the very end. Yeah. So can you see that? So right there's your bead. Perfect. So it's just gonna roll this up, get the air out. So we don't want any air in the bubble. Make sure the powder don't come out with it, dear. Look how much air's come out there. Yeah, it looked completely flat. Yeah, no, it did. Okay. More air in there than right. Okay. So now we're going to put it onto the electric inflator. Um, before I do that, do you want to put the lid back on that? Yes, please. Yes. <laughs> there you go. He does go around. <laughs> he just passed me 260p, please, um, Greg. Which one, please? Yeah, can you just take the air out for me, please? Thank you. Chief air taker out. Oh, yeah, you the... are. Okay, so I'm just going to inflate this with air onto the electric pump. Off with my hand pump. Okay. So when you're inflating your bubbles, you want to make sure there's no wrinkles yeah. in the bubbles. Okay, twist it round. And then with your 260 that's had the air taken out, hold it nice and tight and it round. Sorry. <laughs> okay, so I've gone round five times with that. And then just tying it tightly. So always use a 260Q or a um, 160Q or a 350Q to tie off. I like 260s. And I've got gold here everywhere. Oh, yeah. Gold oh, leaf. There it is. That's it. Okay. So there's our um, bubble. Very cool. So if you just want to hold that for hold me, that. please. Thank you. And what have we done with the hoop? Thank you. Okay. So with the hoop, we're just going to attach it so it sits in the middle. Okay. Okay, and I'm just gonna tie it on like that. Okay, so it's not sitting right at the moment. So I'm just gonna do a couple of little clusters there okay. to hold it on to, to um to finish it off. I'm gonna sneeze again. I feel it's it, that, it must be that gold flake. Or well, you're allergic to one of the two. <laughs> oh, any questions, anybody? Leave your comments on Facebook and on YouTube. Yeah. Oh, any comments? I don't questions, just any comments. <laughs> okay. Okay, so I'm going to do last one. I will hold that. Flames, thank you. Right. There's magnets here. Are they supposed to be on there? Uh, not, no, they weren't, but they, they found their way on. But we'll use them. <laughs> we'll use them. Okay. So this last one, it's going to do a cluster of four, and that's going to sit further down. 
Let's try and do it to that camera. Yeah. Yeah. Well, okay. Yeah. So I'm just going to bring it in from one side. Twist it over the over the um, hoop. Yeah. Is that sitting? Okay. Like that. That's I'm nice. going to put one little more balloon on. So with this, you ideally you could um, vinyl it as well. Yeah. Um, Personalise it. You could also do this. If you had uh, a gender reveal, again, and the parents didn't want the black and white, they wanted yeah. it more natural, which I've done in the past before, you can do exactly the same with the uh, holy powder or confetti or little balloons inside. Okay. Okay. That's it. Very good. Yeah. So the idea is this can hang, okay, from either the ceiling or from a tree if you're yeah. having a garden party. Yeah. Um, and you just attach some uh, fishing line mm -hmm. up and then if it's going to a magnetic ceiling, which we'll do, you can put it on there. But because we've got so much raffia going on here, I'm just going to add a little bit more raffia on. Um, and just tighten the double knot. So that raffia can go quite a long way. It does, it? yeah. I'm going to be using it all afternoon, the raffia. So we can cut that out as well that later on. And then you can either, if you've got, now you've got a magnetic ceiling, the click magnets are yeah. really good. Um, and we're just going to attach that on. I'm just going to twist it Yeah, the it click around. magnets are surprisingly strong, aren't yes, they? Yes, I love them. We've got them all over the fridge as well. And stuff. <laughs> they get everywhere. They're really good. Really handy. During our COVID times, when we started doing BMTV again and we had a guest and we had the screen in between, that was held up yeah, by the magnets. By the magnets. Yeah. Okay. So I was just going to put that there. Oh, maybe that's not magnetic. Okay. <laughs> okay. Right. Okay. So what we can do, I think we didn't test this yesterday. We, I tied it. So I'm just going to tie it. The powers of live TV, eh? What if that's not magnetic? Ooh. No. Well, <laughs> Absolutely. Live TV. Yeah. Got to love it. And then we just trim it down. Let me check this. Let me check this. Oh, that one wasn't on. Yeah, I'm just going to leave that in quite like that. Very nice. Okay. Yep. Like it a lot. Good. Okay, right, let's get rid of this for a minute. Okay. Any oh, I've questions? had a couple of comments. Does Balloon Market sell the gold leaf flake? Yes, yes. we do. Sorry. I think just gold flake. Type that into, into the search. I think. Um, how could I make such a design? Sit on the table as a centerpiece. Uh, okay, so if you did a cluster base, maybe depending on the size, um, eights and eights and fours, and you can wrap the, the hoop into the. So eight inch balloons is what you mean. Yeah, eight, and then yeah, four seven, inch balloons yeah. on top of that, and then just and then, wrap it around. Yeah, probably have to make sure you've got quite a weight at the bottom. Put the weight in, yeah, but that well, you can wrap the cluster over the, the hoop, yeah, yeah, and it will stand. There you go. Okay. Right, let's get rid of this. Yolanda, one. what are the magnets called? Um, they are click click magnets. Click, click, okay, magnet. What's the actual name for them? Can you remember? They come in two I sizes, don't they? No, the mag move is a pole, isn't it? We do sell click, the magnets. Click move. Yes. Yeah, they are just click yeah, click yeah. magnets. magnets. What magnets? Ring magnets, I think, because they've got the ring on the top. So ring magnets. There you go. I think there's different um, different sizes. We've got the big ones, and we've got that's a little one over there. Oh, super ring magnets. These ones are. One holds ten pound. One holds twenty five pound. I think. Really? I think so. I could be wrong. But I'm sure I just that's... know they're really strong. Yeah. We've we've done all sorts of things on this ceiling here. No, so. definitely. Uh, okay. Anyway. We're we moving on. We are. We are. Excellent. Right. Okay. So, looking at um, hanging designs, we're going to do um, like a pinata type design. Okay. Okay. And we're using the 18 inch diamond clears. Okay. So, 
So these are the balloons that you used in the stuffing machine, is that right? Yes. Okay. That's cool. it. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to make a gumball. So, Ooh. I mean, most public people probably know how to make a gumball, but I just recap it for those okay. that, that don't. Okay, so 18 inch, and I'm going to put the um, five inch inside. So you can do it on the electric machine, or if you've got the um, premium as well, or the Conwin, you can do it ma um, automatically. And if you're doing it manually, I'm just going to show you. So I'm going to do four pumps. One, two, three, four. Pull the neck of the five inch up. Push, push it down and then tie off. And then cut, I'm cutting the beads off. Yep. I don't like the beads in mine. So a little bit of air on the outside one. And, just keep, and that one will plug it. Okay. So just keep going. So how many would you normally put in? We don't need to do them all. No, we'll but... just do them. Yeah, just do a few. Um, about Probably about... About 11, I think okay. I did on yesterday's one, and then just keep using your machine. You don't... Okay, like that. So you yeah. just keep going and going and going. Um, into this, we're going to use the party streamers. Okay. Okay. So, going to use confetti as well, I really like. Yeah, confetti. and the confetti. All right. Okay. So, just with these um, party streamers. Oh, there's confetti. Look, 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 look. That's it. <laughs> This is old really school. Handy. I love this. It's childhood memories. This stuff is. So this, I'm just going to um, uh, separate it, and then I'm just going to push it yep. in. Okay. So put that in. I put about six in the final one. Okay. And then with the confetti again, you can just. This is paper confetti. Yeah. Like a card. It's really nice. And until yesterday, I'd never used it before, but I really like it. Thick, isn't it? Yeah, and it is. this will look really good. That's really in the nice quality. So, again, you can put that in by hang manually or shove it in with um, a funnel. Shove it in, Lucy. Shove it in. Shove it in. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but one thing you must do with this is use um, high shine, yeah, or balloon shine, whatever you want to use. Why is that? It stops it oxidizing. Okay, so um, your balloons because it's got no pigment in. Your balloon's going to oxidize a lot quicker, so it's going to go okay. really cloudy. So the one that I did um, earlier, that was done on Saturday, and it still looks really clear. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Awesome. So I'm not going to show you the, all of that. We'll show you the final part. Okay. All right? That's good. Okay. So with the colors I've picked out on here, I've based it on this fan design. Yeah. Okay. So the fans come in packs of threes. So three different sizes, small, medium, and large. Okay, and then I can do, I can do this. Do you want to do this? Yeah, you can do. Oh, you, you do not want to. <laughs> yeah, I mean, no, you can. no, you can. I just I've got a separate, I've got a special size I want. Okay. Oh. I've done it anyway. Look. There you go. That's it. They're easy to do. They are. Okay. I can do them. Oh, it's just. Yeah. Okay. Why is, it, why is it done that? Oh, you've got to stick it. It's got sticky. Does yes, it got sticky it's got stuff? sticky inside it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, I didn't take the sticky off. So I take the sticky off. Ooh. That's it, and then just stick it together. That's it. There you go, look at that. Brilliant. If I can do it, anyone can do it. <laughs> there you go. Okay, so with our fans, I've, set, I've put some fishing line in between or monofilament in between. So okay. did you, you cut that neck bit off? Yes, so I'll, I'll okay. show you with this one. So okay. I've opened it up. I'm going to take the sticky off and I want roughly the same sort of distance between my bottom fan to my top fan okay oh Yolanda's asking a question yeah next time we're going to do it this time Yolanda it will be available afterwards we are I know Yolanda as well hi Yolanda and um, yeah we have got product list coming out okay so with the um fan all I'm going to do is put the mono through to the halfway point okay okay and if you just want to hold that there for us, please, Greg. Thank you. And then at the bot at the um, the middle, I'm coming out with my mono. Okay. And then folding that back over. Okay. Okay. And then I'm gonna grab some a little bit of stretchy balloon tape. So I'm just cutting a tiny little bit of stretchy balloon tape. You could use cellar tape on this, it doesn't have to be a stretchy boom. And I'm just sticking it. Okay. Okay, 
and then I'm going to cut this bit off because I don't want it on there. So cutting the cardboard piece off. No, don't, cut that. don't cut that bit. That's it. Okay. And then for the, um, the bottom, I'm just going to run the mono down to the edge of the fan and then again, a tiny piece of sellotape or stretchy balloon tape just to hold it. Are you left-handed? No, but I do hold... Yeah, yeah, I Why do. Why you put your scissors on the left-hand side if you're right-handed? Yeah, because my mic's here. I didn't want oh, to... Um, okay. Yeah. All right. All right. I tie my balloons with my left hand. Do you? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Even though you're right-handed? Yeah. Cack-handed. <laughs> 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 okay. So we've got three different sizes, and they're going to be hanging. All right. Very like nice. That. Okay. So that's the top of our design. And true Blue Peter style, we're going to get here the one we made earlier. Where, which way, the, which way? the second bag, please. This one? Yeah, thank you. <clears throat> Ooh. I'm just going to cut that off. I'll cut that bit off. Okay. Okay. Okay, so you can see how shiny it is with the, the high shine. This one was done yesterday, and I've high shined the, the top cluster yeah, as well. Yeah, yeah. Very nice. Okay, so cluster of four to three and a half pumps, uh, sorry, three and a half inches um, on top. And we're just going to take, so with your balloons, you always go biggest component at the bottom, smallest at the top. Yeah. Okay. So we're going to take the biggest fan. Yeah. Okay. And then all I'm going to do is just attach it with the mono around the cluster so it sits. Okay. And we just tie off in a permanent knot. I don't know how you do that so easily with the fishing line. I, I just struggle to even see it. <laughs> That's one thing I can see is fishing line. I couldn't see the menu last night for dinner, but I can see that. <laughs> Was that vodka related though? No, no, okay. no, no, no. <laughs> Gin last night, no. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, so that this is going to be our... A hanger. So if you've got a really tall ceiling, yeah, you can hang it. If you wanted to put a cluster up here as well, you can yeah. do a cluster of eight inches and six inches in exactly the same colour. And then the, the kids or the adult. This one's more of an adult based one, yeah, because we've got the confetti and the streamers in but as it, well. It really it adds volume. It's massive. It does. It's just, it fills it's a big space, yeah, and it, yeah. it's not That's a good way of using these. Of, yeah. Mm -hmm. I like it. Okay, you're okay. going to try and tie it on there. Yeah, we'll tie this one. It's careful because can... it's not attached Okay, so we, we did this yesterday and it didn't, couldn't see it all. So what we're going okay. to do is we're going to attach it like that. You wouldn't normally do this. No, this is no, just, but just for here. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. But we cut, I cut like the way this, this sort of all falls. Random. Random. Yeah. Okay, okay, very good. Okay, so. With the um, the stick, if you are going to use it as a piñata, we're going to use a stick. So I've just taken a kebab stick. Okay, and a little cluster of four yeah. organic. And on. Again, you could change the colour of this if you wanted to. You don't have to leave, but these colours work together. Yeah. So I'll just put that on. And then we just use the streamers again. And I'm just going to wrap them around. Quite a cool idea using a uh, balloon as a piñata. Is that your idea? No. <laughs> oh, okay. No. We we saw we saw it on camera and then we sort of adapted it, didn't we? For the piñatas. You saw it where? Um, on the context. Okay. Facebook page, yeah. Okay. And then if you if you, if you want these a bit more curly. Just run them down your fingernails. Very nice. Or you could use a pet scissors to... There are a lot of piñatas out there, though, in the market. I keep seeing lots of really nice piñata designs. Yeah, yeah. I think they're coming on. And it's a little bit different from, like, the kids going mad and whacking it. What, with balloons, you mean? Yeah, I've seen oh, quite right. a few okay. on Instagram. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. Okay. That's very nice. And then you can just pop it. Okay, good. Okay. We're not going to pop it. No. <laughs> no. I would. Yeah, you you want to pop it? <laughs> no. Okay. Julie's saying pop it. Should we no. pop it? No. Let's have a vote. No. We'll pop, yeah. We'll have let, a let, vote. Let, let's see if people want us to okay. pop it or not. I think it looks pretty. I think it's, it's great to just leave it as it is. Julie, behind the camera, saying pop it, pop it. <laughs> so what do you think, the viewers out there? Should we pop it? 
Nobody cares, Julie. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, we've got one poppet. We've got to give it. We got. We need a. Oh, Londa says no. Oh, that's one and one. <laughs> okay, okay, one yes, one we'll no. We'll do one more. Let's, let's show one more pop, design. Pop it. Oh, yeah. I think I think popping it is going to be what we're going to have to do. Pop it. Pop it, pop it, pop it. <laughs> All right, where's it going? Where's my You know what? We're just, we're just not going to pop it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Maz says no. It looks so pretty. Okay, we're going to go with Maz. We're not going to pop it. Okay. No, where we should pop it. Oh. Sorry, more, more, Go more puppets than not. So, oh, I'm going to pop You're it. You're going to make a mess. I don't like those noises. I know. <laughs> you don't like the oh, yeah, it makes either. a mess. We've got to tidy it up. We're not going to pop it. <laughs> oh, okay. Julie, do you want to pop it? You pop it. No, you pop it. <laughs> Someone pop it. <laughs> oh, Maz is upset. Maz, Maz is, is, is going to leave the live. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, cool. No, that, oh, it doesn't want to pop, you see. Hey! <laughs> It that makes a mess. Cool, it? That you are going to clean that up. <laughs> Look at it. Yeah, exactly. Stuck to the wall. Very nice. <laughs> Very good. Thank you, Julie. Okay, so we're going to do another. Thank you, Lucy. That was good. That's all right. We're I mean, just kind do... of good. This is you've, you've yeah, properly made a mess. Back. Okay, so we've got another variation now on the okay. um, on the hanging balloons pinata. So if you just want to grab that one for us, please, Greg. What this one? Yes, please. Ooh. Spooky scary, by the looks of it. Yes. <gasps> Spooky scary skeleton. Any TikTok fans would know that song? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I've only just signed up to TikTok. I'm not. Oh, Andrew, you're a bit late. Stick a bucket underneath, then pop it. That would have been very sensible. Well done. Didn't think of that, Julie, did you? No. <laughs> okay. Right. Okay, so with this one, we've just taken a 14 inch spider yeah. uh, with two six uh, with a, a fishing line, stretchy bloom tape, attachment point, and then a cluster underneath. And then we've run the, the cobweb that you sell here yeah. all through the design. And again, you can hang this up. And with the, if it's Halloween, then you can put all your sweets and stuff inside yeah, yeah. as well. That's great. Okay, but with this one, we're going to make slightly different. Um, uh popper with this one okay but we're not okay. going to pop it no 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 we'll i don't it. think we should, should we hang it yeah yeah hang it hang it looks a bit sad when it's popped but... <coughs> Where's that gone? Oh, jade on. says i know what do you know jade what did i miss How many people we've got on YouTube? How many we've got on Facebook? Do we know that, Alex? Can we see that or not? Uh, no, I can't see. Julie, can you just pass us the orange 11 inch, please? <laughs> oh, yeah, and the, the um, uninflated ones as well. Okay, so, so more on YouTube. Cool. Or Hello, all YouTube that, people. In that box over. That's it, isn't it? That's Maz it. says, don't release the spider. <laughs> <laughs> What's, what's this for? What are we doing? Ah, I'm going to do a quick popping design. Uh, a popping oh, yeah, stick, yeah, different yeah. variation on the popping stick. Uh, 160Q, I had them earlier, didn't I? These are like straws. Mm, paper straws. They're quite quite solid ones, yeah, aren't they? Yeah, no, they are. I had really good service the other day. Went to the showcase, went to see Minions, the rise of Gru. It was very good with my daughter. And um, he said, I ordered a drink. And he said, do you want to make that a large one? It's only 30p more. So, of course, I said yes. And um, he gave me two straws because he knows that one straw is go. so good. I thought that was really good service. Yeah, no, definitely. Okay, so we're taking a 160Q and the uh, kebab stick. Make sure you've got the blunt end. And all I'm going to do is just drop it through the straw. Oh. Okay, and then pull the stick out. Okay, and then at the end of this one, we're just going to do um, a little five inch, or we're going to use a chrome this time. You could yeah. use black, five inch black if you wanted to. Just inflate it, deflate it. And this is going to act as a stopper for your straw. I'm intrigued. Oh. Okay, and then I'm just going to tie it to the end of my 160Q. Okay. I've got a bit of air in that one, but we can get rid of the air. 
You can take somebody's eye out. Yeah, no, it's coming out. It's coming out. I'm getting rid of it. Okay, so just trim down the excess. Make sure. Oh, I I'm... see. Jade was agreeing with Andrew being too late for the bucket. Yes, it was. <laughs> it was. It was quite amusing, though. Okay, so we're going to take this um, kebab stick out now. Diane's asking, do I have OCD? Why are you asking that, Diane? Why? <laughs> Why? What, do I, what am I doing that makes you think I've got OCD? I do like things a certain way. Okay. Whenever so... there's balloons lined up, I'm filming BMTV. And I like to line up the 260s if there's 260 being used. And um, people just like to mess them up for me. It's, it's quite upsetting. <laughs> Especially me. Yeah. Right. Okay, so that's going to hold like that. I'm just going to put that to one side. Um, we're going to put something on the end of your stick now to, to tie in with a Halloween thing. Okay. And obviously you can get a bit more money for it as well. So just inflate an 11 inch, stretch it, let it down, and inflate it again. Okay. And I'm going to tie it close to the neck. Okay. Okay, so now we're going to make an apple twist. Yep. Okay, but before I do the apple twist, I'm just going to take some excess uh, modeling balloon, so 160Q, 260Q, and then tie tie to the end, so we want it an attachment point. Okay, so with my thumb, I'm going to go all the way through the, the balloon, down to the end, grab that knot, and twist it around. And I'm just going to put this excess on. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Till it's going to be yet? I have no idea. No? This, this is really okay. interesting. Okay. So okay. using the um, 160Q that's gone through the straw, yeah. I'm going to tie it really tightly to the straw. Okay. okay. And then I'm going to cut it off. I love it when I have no idea where this is going. <laughs> This is great. Julie, could you just pass out a vinyl, please? The, uh, the ones on top, the uh, black one? Uh, no, there's... Uh, um, uh, the, oh, have you got the next one down? For that one, Jade. Uh, oh, Londo I, says it's because I clean up every spec. Yeah. And Jade, yes, I have seen Monk many years ago. I have. I, I remind, I remind her of, of him. He was a bit OCD. That would do it. Yeah, please. Yeah. So anything that can I can use, I think. So on here. Hi, Steb. Steb, say hello on the camera. Come in. Come in. Come in. Hi, <laughs> Steb. Hello. <laughs> 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 okay. So I've just cut a kebab stick down. Okay. Okay. And then that's going to go in here into the 160Q. And you, if you had a green one, you could use a green one for the yeah. stem of the, uh, can you tell what it's going to be? Is it pumpkin? It's going to be a pumpkin. It would have been, yeah, a pumpkin. Okay. And we, I like the way that it's sort of off-centre because it's going to give the kids longer time to pop the design. Okay. So you could have two two um, two groups. You could do ghosts. You could do pumpkins, teams. And then we're just going to we use, okay, so this is just fine. How does that not come out, though, that, that stick? It's, it stayed in. I pushed it all the way to the end okay. and just tied the, the knot off. Obviously, you need to have an adult with them when they're doing oh, it. Oh, I see. You tied the knot sort of a little bit yeah, down. Yeah, further so down see. to the bit. Okay. Uh, oh, a smiley pumpkin. Yeah, whatever. Cute one. Okay. So this one could be as a popper. So I like the idea that it's moving. You can get it static if you wanted to. Yeah. You could put like a more static straw on it. But it's just to give the kids extra time. So it's just more of a challenge. Yes. So yeah. Because yeah, you don't want them bursting it the first time. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. okay. Very cool. So, yeah. And then I'm not, I won't pop it. Well, you can so, if you want to. Yeah. No. So inside up. here, we've got a 14 inch spider <laughs> yeah. hanging down. And uh, we can pop that. Okay. All right. Any questions? Oh. No, image. Grisel, Grisel. Grisel. Say the name. Grisel, Grisel. From Tampa, Florida. Blurry image, or is it just me? We don't, we don't think it's us. So we think it might be you. Sorry. Maybe the internet connection, the broadband. Let's call it broadband in the States. Is it called broadband in the States? Anybody know? 
I don't know. Anyway. I don't know. But no, we, do, we don't think we're blurry. Is that it? It is for that. One more. Very good. Oh, you got one more. Okay. Get rid of that. I didn't mean to say disappointed. Oh, you got one more. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not <laughs> oh, <disappointed>. cheers. <laughs> it's just you're whizzing through them. That's all. You're whizzing okay. through them. So we're going to do some little cute designs now on boxes. Oh, yeah. That is so cute. Like it. Okay. Like so it these lot. are the, the favourite boxes. Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm just going to make sure get these. Oh, there's other ones down there. Yeah. You can Are we not getting those out It's up to you. Okay, okay, I'm going to get them out. We just need a bit of... Oh, this one's got a name. Alice. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's a football one. That's it. For the women. It's for quite, the, uh, quite apt, isn't it? Yes, definitely. Definitely. Okay, so these are the um, blue white boxes. Have you have, have you got our thank you sweets? I did. I nicked some. Yep, I did. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm showing you how to use them. Okay. I'm showing you all how right, to okay, use them. All right, okay, all right. Okay. I thought you'd just take us some. Yes, no, no, I did ask. I think you'd take them. It's all right. I would, I would, I, I'm only joking. I'm only joking. <laughs> okay. Right, so with the um, favour boxes, I'm going to make them up. And obviously you can use these as a weight box, but we're yeah. going to use them as a little favour for the um, for the children. Okay. Um, so to do that, we're going to use a 14-inch foil. Yep. We're going to heat seal it. You absolutely do make such a I do. mess. I do. Those people that I mean, know me. you've got me. gold leaf over there. You've I know. Got, oh, confetti. <laughs> Julie, I'll take it all back. <laughs> Um, that could be the question. Am I the messiest person you've ever worked with? Um, I don't know. I think it's the creative mind. Yeah, that's I, it. I can't think who. I'm not going to name names. That, <laughs> okay. would, that would be unfair. <laughs> Tell me after. <laughs> okay. okay, so 14 inch. Because it's a 14 inch, hasn't got a valve, you need to heat seal it. Yep. So I'm just going to inflate it. So it's tight and then just clamp my thumb and first finger down. Yeah. So I'm just going to hold it by the um, the neck near the near the hole. And with the heat sealer, I'm going to go into the heat sealer and I'm going to um, heat seal it as near to the hole as possible because okay. if you make a mistake, you can cut it and reuse the, the foil. Okay. So I'm going to move the llama's legs, push it, push the heat sealer down. It clicks to say it's gone. So I'm going to leave it just for a couple of seconds to make it tack. And just make sure you've got no um, wrinkles in the neck of your foil. I'm going to put one more. You know, years ago, years and years ago, we got an order for some heat seal balloons from a local farm. Mm. And it's one of these visitor farms that you go to. And I was the one heat sealing them. <laughs> I just got it wrong so many times. Oh, they right. said, oh, they're not sealed properly. But of course, I didn't know the double heat seal yeah. technique back mm -hmm. then. So you do it twice. Yeah. I, yeah. And there's a, people do it different. And some people pull it through yeah, as well. Yeah, but um, yeah. yeah. I find it quite therapeutic doing heat sealing. I'll sit in yeah. front of the telly and watch it. Yeah. Okay. So it's going to take a 260. We're using a 160. Fold and roll the neck. So we've got a pinata thing going on today, haven't we? Not necessarily. Indeed. Okay. So with the sweet. Uh, or an Encanto box. theme. It's quite Encanto ish, isn't mm. it? The colours. Yeah. Or Minecraft. That like that. Oh, yeah. That's nice. Nice. Okay, right, so put the box together. Okay, put your little sweets in that you nicked yep. earlier. Yeah. <laughs> okay, and with this one, I'm just going to fold the tabs down. So the tabs are going down first, the rings. Okay, and then folding the holes in. Okay. Taking the 160 through the design. Because we've got the sweets in, a little bit of a wiggle. Through. That's it. Make sure it sits back down again. Okay, so I'm pulling that in. Yep. And then just take a little bit of balloon tape. And stretching that through. All right, they just take that on. There. Yeah. Cool. Okay, and then if you wanted to, just cut the yeah, cut the other end off. You only need one bit. So all my scraps of my two sixties and one sixties I keep. Yeah. Okay, and then all I did with these ones 
there's just vinyl some names on yeah you put them on so those ones they haven't got any sweets in at all but it's just to show you so the sweets or whatever you put inside there would would help keep that, the shape that down of the, yeah of the, definitely um, so and if there. if you didn't want to um run the 260 through what you can do is i take it we sell these you do oh we are eight yeah. in a packet yeah very nice so. i like yeah. the the ombre color mm. mm -hmm. very good so with these ones as well if you didn't want to go into the box just make your box up so mm -hmm. fold the hips down and then again a scrap of a 160 or 260 and then you could make a little flower okay just and then put your that. put your design yeah, on very nice okay very good okay. wonderful right have i got any other questions let me see i've not had a look so you've got the heat sealer from america yeah heat sealer in america nice. 20 dollars very cheap um what a great idea diane glad you like them cheryl's loving the live <laughs> all right excellent any other questions from anybody out there you whiz through those Sorry. <laughs> it's all right. It's not a bad thing. It's not a bad thing. Maybe it's just Julie takes the time. <laughs> <laughs> no. Not at all right. All. We've got another. You got another got one. More. We've got more. Oh space. my word! Yeah. We need to sweep mics. Oh, okay. Are we gonna? Are we gonna swap? Sure. We're, we're gonna okay. go. We're gonna have a quick break and tidy up. To be fair. Tidy up. I'm gonna yes. do that. All right. See you in a second.
My money doesn't get the bigger bit folds. Do you like that? I don't know what it is you're doing. Oh, never mind. Oh, we're wrong. <laughs> oh, hello. Um, hi, everybody. Greg from Blue Mag. You know who I am. You know what's going on. Um, just having a little um, sing song. Little there. drumming. My money thing. don't jiggle jiggle. It folds. You don't know that. I don't know it. No, I think you need to give me a little bit more of it so I can grasp what it is you're I, I can't to remember the rest of the words. My daughter knows. Oh, okay. It's Louis Theroux. Okay, never mind. Anyway, everybody, we're back. <laughs> And Julie's back. I'm back. Sorry. Um, <laughs> before we go any further, I've been told I've got to talk about Qualitex Fundamentals training because you're coming down doing that. Aren't you? Yes. Okay. When is it? Yes, it's on the I should 31st, know, really. of, 31st, 31st of August, of August here at Balloon Market. All right. Oh, sorry, we've got another one. When is it? 21st of November as well. So two Qualitex Fundamentals. If you're new to the industry, it is a fantastic course to learn the basics. And you get to meet Julie. Sorry. Sorry. Um, <laughs> so, but it's a really, really good course. Highly recommend it. And uh, Julie is actually a very good trainer, despite the abuse that I can I can't be professional. Yeah, she's, she's, she's actually very good. So, um, yeah, if you are interested, head over to bloommarket.co.uk, click on the training banner, and um, you can you can see, what was it, 21st of August and the 31st of August. 31st of November, not the 21st, no, sorry. No, 31st of August. 31st of August, sorry. <laughs> I, I don't know. Just 31st of August, 21st of November is when the Qualtex one Perfect. So keep Got throwing these little That's things in. Well <laughs> Balloonmarket.co.uk, click on the training <laughs> banner and you can see all the details there. Anyway, all right, all right, right. back to you. Just to like mix things up a bit, I'm going to do another baby design. Okay. I, I don't know why I seem to have got it's the fine, theme of fine. babies. You're allowed to. At the moment. Okay, so I'm going to start with a base, and this is just a single layer base. So normally you, I'd put like another yep. pod on top, but I'm just going to do one. What is it? Itchy nose. I, I, I don't know. I don't maybe know it's it maybe, maybe it's our perfume. Yeah. <laughs> and there. I just tell you. Before we went live, <laughs> Julie put some perfume on. <laughs> oh I, my did, life, I did say I don't know why I'm doing this because people can yeah, but it makes you feel happier about yourself. Oh, clearly, clearly. <laughs> All right, sorry, carry on. Thanks for that, Greg. <laughs> really appreciate it. No worries. Keep it real, Julie. Keep it real. <laughs> Okay, so. Do you want me to move this bag out of the way and then I can hand Yeah, them you can me. hand them to me, that'd be great. Tell Thank me when you. you want me. That's quite heavy. What's in there? A weight, I think. Okay. I've prepared a weight for this one. All right. Very good. Okay, so. so this is a 38 inch baby boy foil balloon 433326. Actually, can you pass me the weight, please? Okay. 
Oh no, I've just knocked a whole bunch of 260s on the floor. Is that it? Is it? Oh, there it is. Oh, yeah, Thank you. Sand or water? Well, sand. Ooh, scary. <laughs> so I'm just going to tie that into the base to start with. And then I've air inflated this baby um, and I'm going to tie in. Now, what I've done here is I've made some little bows in exactly the same way as we did do before. But so when you've got a foil balloon and it's got a small, it's got like in two sections like yeah, this yeah. and the bigger part is bigger than the smaller part, it can be a bit floppy. Wobbly, yeah, yeah. yeah. So there's different ways you can, you can rectify it. So you could put a little bit of helium in it which would help as well but i thought well not everybody's using helium at the so moment so you wouldn't need to fully inflate it with helium no. you could have air and helium yeah okay. just a little bit just to give it so it's yeah. got a little bit of buoyancy and then finish it off with air and yeah. um, a lot of people tend to put like um string of pearls around it yeah, yeah. but i thought with this it looked like it was like being choked yeah absolutely. so i thought i've just done a little bow on on this side so just here and then one on the opposite side okay. so it just gives it a bit of stability good idea yeah, I thought well, so. Yeah. I do have them every now and then. Oh, you thought of that, did you? Yeah, I do. Oh, right. I know, it's a shocker, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> so I'm just, I'm just going to um, attach my 260 to my file so I can tie it into the base then. And then I'm just going to pull it straight into here. It's a bit of gold flake there. I don't know where that's 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 come from, Lucy. <laughs> gold flake everywhere. Well, at least you can't blame me for it this time. I've had no, no. gold flake. I've been finding it for weeks. Yeah. Right, so that's quite cute already. I mean, you, could, you could sell that on its own, couldn't you? Yeah, you could. Yeah. yeah. But the reason I've done a single base like this is because I want to use something else, another product oh, okay. that we've got. So can you pass me, um, there should be two long foils in there. Ah, yes. Da, da, da. Okay. So these are our... Um, There's a couple of other little balloons in there. Do you want those out yet or not? Yeah, you can get them out. Our bon banner foils, these come in packs of two, so you get both um, yep. in each pack. And um, what I've done is I've just put a little 260 onto the end of each one yep. because I want to attach them together. And then what all I'm going to do, I need to do a 260 on that one. I don't want on that you don't, it's 260 on that end. No. Yeah, but I'm going to time together. So I want one on both ends so all I right, can time okay. together. Okay. I won't tell you what to do. <laughs> It usually don't work. No, no. What, me telling you what to do? Yeah. Oh, no. It kind of makes me do the opposite. Yeah. Good to know. <laughs> right, so what I'm going to do is bring it round. Will you hold it for me, please? I will, yeah. Well, I tie. And I've inflated these balloons to eight inches and yeah. I've worked out that eight inches makes these two join together perfectly. It's perfect, perfect. size. Very good. Okay, so I just want to cover these mechanics up a little bit at the sides where I've tied them together. So what I'm going to do is... So you don't even need to sticky tape those <laughs> or anything like that? Or glue dot them no, I would. I'd put a little bit of balloon bond, yeah. Okay. I would, just to make sure it's not going to go. Because, you They're know... quite tight, though. They're quite nice. It is, but if it goes to a customer's, you know, you don't want it to fall off when it's there. True because that. they won't know. Yep. Um, so I would. I'd just put, just in a couple of points, I'd put a little bit of balloon bond. Are there any some questions, people? Got any questions? Lucy, what are you doing? Lucy's on her phone making noises. <laughs> That's a big no-no in the BMTV studio. Do you want to get your pump? Where's my pump? Is this one? Which one's mine? Oh, here it is. It says Greg on it. Right, we're going to do <laughs> a split duplet. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, so we're going to do two pumps, and then when we, we're going to tie it. So when we tie it, we're not going to tie it tight like we would do there. We're going to tie it a little bit lower down. Okay. 
Oh, they, see, this is me tying tying knots and stuff. Do you want me to tie it for you? Yeah. I got one. <laughs> right. So if you're doing, if you just want little small balloons, yeah. well, one way that you can do it is by doing a split duplicate. So it means oh, that we're yeah. going to split the balloon in half. So if you get the knot and press down on the center, make sure you've got half of the balloon in one side, in one side of your hand and half in the other, and then just twist. And you can oh. squeeze. <laughs> So you need to make need sure to you've got your knot. finger. Got it, got it, yeah. got it, got it. And then you can squeeze the air from one side to the other. So you've got my finger stuck amount. in there, Julie. Look, is well, it not supposed to be? <laughs> no. Put your finger on it like that. Okay. That's it. Do you ever wonder why I don't get involved for being too big? I do, actually. But it's more fun getting involved, okay. isn't it? It's boring just sitting on the sidelines. All right. And then what you can do is you can just put, cross them over like that. Hang on, you do that bit. I think you should have a go. No. Go on, go on, do it, do it, do it. If I get it wrong, don't blame me. All right. And then just twist it. Yeah. There you go. Fab. Get me. I'm a balloon artist. <laughs> <laughs> You're still not getting your CBA yet. All right. Oh, can you pass it out? Sorry, I'm Fair not getting enough. it. I'm just going across oh. you now. I'm, I've stopped. I've stopped being good. Right, okay. So I've just used these little, um, little star foils and we've just personalized them with the babies so the name on one and then the date of birth on yep. the other and then all i'm going to do i've just like balloon bond them into there because they're not it's don't need to be mechanically you know strong just yeah. a bit of balloon bond will be fine it's not structural that's it that's what you're trying to say <laughs> do you it want is, to, isn't it? it is exactly do you want to do one no, and i'll do the other stop asking me oh, look, I, I know i thought i'd stick it on the wrong side so, there's some for you. Where do I put it? Oh, hang I'm taking on. it off. I don't know what to do with it now. <laughs> right, hang on. We need it to go. Here. Where? There? Yeah, the other way around. Like that? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. Sure, that's the right spot. I won't say to put it in a different place. I promise. Yeah. There you go. I don't want to get it wrong, so. We'll do it together. I'll Just do my side and it. you do yours, okay, okay. and then you'll be able to see where it goes then. I can't always guarantee mine won't work. Then press it down. I'm pressing it down. <laughs> there! Hey, yay! it works! So that's a really quick, easy design to do, isn't it? Can I have my CBA now? No. Okay. Tell everybody what CBA is. CBA is Certified Balloon Artist. So you join... Um, Which is a Qualitex run thing, isn't it? Yeah, it is. And it's just, you go through a series, series, series. You go serious, through a, series. <laughs> you go through a series of... Um, You've got to get yourself on the camera. Okay. Oh, sorry. Um, you go through a series of um, education, so you get like a booklet and you get some DVDs and things like that to watch, and then you do a little test after each one, and then once you've passed all those, you go on and do a practical exam, um, and then when once you've done that, and it's all every in the exams, it's all things that you've learned through mm -hmm. the booklets and and the DVDs, so it's really good. And even if you're not really bothered about becoming a certified balloon artist as such, it's really good way to learn all the the yeah the basics and it teaches you about design and the principles it goes into a bit and elements more detail of design as well, and stuff doesn't like it? that. Yeah. Fundamentals for yeah, definitely. Yeah. 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 So it's a really good thing to do. And then you become part of the Qualitex Balloon Network. Is yeah. That right? Yeah, that's right. There and then also once you've done your first exam, um it gives you access to um more information, more more um resources and things like yeah. that on the website as well so you can get different designs to with instructions and stuff like that as well fantastic so it's good. very good yeah thank you good fab right oh, can you buy the garland foil balloon from balloon market i think so yes, yes. i can. hope so yeah they come in you've got baby boy baby girl and then you've got another two which lucy's going to come on and show you something okay. hold right on now. have the cba videos been updated now uh, is that ongoing? It's still ongoing. Sorry? It's, it's ongoing. Ongoing. It's on Fingers crossed soon. Very soon. Yeah. 
but Debs you is saying it's very soon so very soon what you can do is you can still if you're wanting to do them you can still you can still start and then because you're a cba all the new resources when, when they become available you'll get automatic access to them anyway yeah, so yeah, you don't yeah. have to wait until it's all available okay. um can you put a link to the cba courses please <laughs> i don't know alex can you do that um, we can put it in the oh. description. Oh. The QBN kit. Yeah, QBN. Okay, QBN kit. Just Google QBN kit, not Google. Um, search on balloonmarket.co.uk. Yeah, yeah. okay, where am I? All right. What a brilliant idea for the live stream. Thank you all involved for making it happen. Feeling so inspired. Thank you, Nora. Wow. Okay, right. So I'll do a quick mic swap with okay. you. Okay. All right. We're swapping over, everybody. I'll just stand here. Oh, you know what? I can tell you about. I think I had one under here. Hold on, I've got I've got a flyer. Not not you. Hold on, you carry on. Um, <laughs> this is our offer at Balloon Market for August: twenty percent off dried flowers. So dried flowers, obviously, very very hot right now. Um, so yeah, we've got we've got twenty percent off them. You don't have to enter a code or anything. Just go on Balloon Market, and it's twenty percent off everything. Um, off those dried flowers. All right. Any questions? Anybody want to ask anything? Well, Lucy gets on. Now Lucy's here. She's still sorting stuff out. Any questions? Ask me anything. Or not. That's fine. No, don't want to talk to you. Right, get, got me too nearly there. Brush. Yeah, got me two sets and I'm done. We'll get there. That's it. Done. Have you had a sandwich? Have you eaten something? No, not yet. I'll let him get the end. Okay, it's getting on a bit. I know. <laughs> I'm just starving. Okay. So right. we've done exactly the same for this one. Okay, run the so bottom. Eight yeah. inch base uh, with the two garlands tied together. Um, what we've done at the top is we've put an attachment point with stretchy balloon tape yep. using the fans again. And then this balloon here comes as part of your garland. Okay. Okay, so it's one of the balloons that are attached. And I, I saw this, um, I learned this technique from Sue Bowler on the yep. What's Hot Right Now course. Sue's watching. Hello, Sue. Hello, Sue. Sue. <laughs> right. Okay. So we're going to use this blue. Hold on. We've got a question from Londa. Mm -hmm. The lives make you nervous. Yes. Yeah. Not really. Oh, Julie says she's Julie nervous. does. She's eating now. She didn't eat before. <laughs> and now she's, she's wolfing food down. <laughs> so... <laughs> That's right. Anyway, carry on. Okay. So we're going to use this balloon, which is right at the very end of the garland. Yep. Okay. So you might want to get close to it. Yeah. Okay. So can you see where the balloon attaches to each other? It's got a little, two little um, heat seal parts. I'm, I'm going to need glasses you for need... this. <laughs> can you see there? That a V? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, there and there. So I'm going to cut in between those Vs. Okay. Okay. So just... Yeah, and I probably should have put my glasses on. Don't think we'll have been able to pick that up on the camera. So you're, you're cutting there's, through there's a little v. where the V is, yeah. mm -hmm. but you're not cutting all the way across. No, I don't want to cut in the V. That's it. Okay. okay. So I'm going to inflate the balloon. And with these packets, they come with a straw attached to it. So you could sell them as a garland yep. and they can use that um, to hang. I'm just going to use a hand pump because it's quicker. inflated yeah okay so i'm going to take the heat seal again oh i see what you're going to do yeah I'm using julie's pump i know yeah, you, need, you need your pump there you go. Thank oh you. yours is messy that's surprise no nah, never <laughs> never 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 okay so look, I'm at gonna... it, look at the state of that what is all of that <laughs> hard work that's what it is <laughs> okay so we're um, going to heat seal now i'm just pushing it apart gently yeah okay i'm going to hope this works Push down, wait for it to a couple of seconds, and then I'm going to put another seal underneath it. Go further along. So you could still use the yeah, other, yeah, the rest yeah. Of it. So you could us. use all of these. You could do exactly the same, I and then you got two, three, five balloons in. Okay, so I've, I've got my heat seal. I'm just going to put one more in. Is it plugged in? Basically? Yeah, it's plugged okay. in. Yeah, it makes that. It's made that. That's it. Yeah. Done that before. <laughs> right. Okay. So I'm just going to cut the other side of the heat seal. Okay. Okay. 
Right. Yeah. Okay. So with this one, I can reseal this. Yeah. Yeah. And go again. Make sure there's no creases, isn't it? So you can still use that as. Yeah. See, that's what I'm saying. Keep going. You can yeah. Still keep use going and going. Yeah. Thing. Cool. Okay. So that's where our little, individual balloon. little hats come from. Yeah. Um, what we did, we used, where's that little balloon gone there? Sorry. So we used a little cupcake. All right, cool. Okay. So what we've got at the top, we're going to replicate underneath in the middle, at uh, the, um, the end of okay. the point of the free. Do to push this up? Yes, Let's please. See. Thank you. Oh, we've got a different fan. Okay. Right. Okay, so we're going to make an attachment point using the stretchy balloon tape. Yep. And if you just take the air out of that for it, oh, please. My Thank you. Right. Skilled at this thing. Done it. Perfect. Thank nice. you. Yeah. So I think we used to... back, right? Yeah. <laughs> you got, got the foil everywhere. All right, that's it. will go for smaller fan. I'm just gonna reuse this one. Let me see what you're doing. Okay, so I'm just reusing it. I could have got a new one. Right. That's it. Okay. So um we're gonna make an attachment point for a fan to sit on the side. Okay. Okay, so a little bit of stretchy balloon tape. Place where I want it to go. Yeah. Just turn that around. You see that? Yeah. Just <laughs> <That's> tidying up. <laughs> so the two sixty key goes underneath. Hold it back onto itself and over. Why did you fold it back onto itself like that? Just to instead sorry. of just going flat onto the balloon. Just so it gives it a little bit of. Um, so it comes away from the balloon oh, a little bit because okay. it's got a bit that's I got a sit in trip. Okay. Okay. Yeah, never seen that before. okay. So with this one, we're going to bring the two uh, the fan through to the two sixty Q. Yeah. And it's going to sit there. Okay. And then just cut these cardboard bits off. Okay. And then we're going to take our little hat. Mm -hmm. And the hat's going to come in front this time. Okay, cool. Okay, so again, another attachment point. And I was going to use that 260, cut that 260 down. Can you see that? Can you see? Right, sorry, just looking where the thing is. There. Okay. So 260, um, stretch your balloon tape. Stick it to the balloon up and over and tie. So we're just going to attach that to that now. I'm just going to tie them together. Yeah. With this, you could use sort of balloon bond, but it's not going to sit flat because of the, the ridges in the fan. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And then that's quite cute, actually. That could go up. I'm just going to cut the excess down. And these little bits here, you could just get some like normal cellar tape or a little bit of stretchy blue yeah. tape or even like balloon bond, yeah. just tape it back. Okay. Very nice. Wonderful. All right. That is very good. Thank right. You. Right, we've got one more. We've got another one. One more. This one wasn't I've, in the I've script got, yesterday. I've got places to be. <laughs> well, not really. Excellent. <laughs> All right, and you're going to do that next one as well. Yeah. Okay. Right. Good. Okay. Nice so where was playing with the raffia yesterday? Sort of come up with something that come that can be used. Yeah. For the design as well. So using a um, just I took you through. Yeah. Okay. So using the deco bubble that we used earlier with the um, gold leaf, gold leaf inside. We just put some raffia at the top. Yeah. And brought it all the way down to the bottom, put an attachment point at the bottom. So you've not put an attachment point up No, there. I just you've tied just it. Literally and just pulled yeah, it down. Okay, pulled it cool. down and around. Okay. Very nice. And then a little cluster at the bottom as well. 
and then that comes down. That goes very well with that, obviously. Yeah, all the colours. And then what I did with this one, this is using the free foot. Yeah. Okay, so I turned it this way around. Okay, and what can you tell me about this? Bit it's there? on the outside. Ah. Yeah, so this is high, this is the um, gold leaf that's on the outside. And this isn't going anywhere. Okay, it's stuck. How did, how did you stick that on? Ah, ready? All right, shall we? I'll put that there for a minute. Okay. okay so. Funny you should ask, Greg. Yeah. Let's use that. That's empty. Use this packet. Okay, a little bit of high flow. Louis has said... Um, will this be posted on the channel afterwards? Yes, it will. It will be on Facebook, it will be on YouTube, and it will be in our resources page at balloonmarket.co.uk. Alonda says, more, more, more. Not too sure if she's talking about Alex, or maybe <laughs> she's wanting more content. Um, but I'm sure we can get Alex on more, more time. Definitely. Okay, so we've got your favourite product again, Greg. No. Oh, don't sound too excited. <laughs> I'm very excited. Yes, love it. Woo! Okay. So if you want to hold that for me, please. So I've just used a brush. Well, yesterday I used my fingers, but today I thought I'd be a bit okay. more professional and use a brush. So it's, a, it's a makeup brush. I might have a little bit of makeup well, on. What are you, what are you, what are you I'm just doing? painting the high flight onto the blue. Oh, is that on it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Sorry, I missed that. I was doing comments. I didn't realize you just squished <laughs> some high floats on there. Yeah, some oh, right. squish so high flight. High flow. I didn't realize yeah. you used high floats as oh, blue. Yeah. It looks really great on a bubble, outside of a bubble. Yeah. Really nice. Cool. Okay. And uh, where did I put it? I've lost my point now. Where did I do it? <laughs> Can't see it. Okay. So I'm just going to push that on. Very nice. Mm -hmm. So I've just done it at random points all the way, just to give that balloon a little bit of shimmer. Okay, and these look really nice on cluster bases as well. Yeah. So if you do a cluster base, a little bit of high float onto the um, five-inch balloon and then put a bit of gold leaf, silver leaf, rose gold yeah. leaf on. Very good. Now we've got a couple more comments. Oh, Londa was talking about the content. Oh, well, she... Yeah. <laughs> uh... <laughs> I think his girlfriend yeah. might have said to say uh, about Alex, that. <laughs> Alex is pretending not to love this, but he's loving it really. And... Uh... Louis um, from Hong Kong. Wow, Hong Kong. We've got people from all over the world today. It's fantastic. And gender really reveal thing has gone so popular this year. Brilliant. That is fantastic. Okay, is that it? That's it. So this is that a is it. Design. Well, everybody, okay. we're done. We just saw demo day. Done. Um, I, I think I, I I think we need to say thank you to Lucy, and we need to say thank you to Julie. Julie, you've got to come back on. Oh, how many how many days will the gold leaf stay on for? It's ages, just ages, ages and ages yes, no, until the balloon goes. Yeah, until right, the balloon right, goes. Hold on, I just need to do this. <laughs> All right, so there we are. We should do a question of the week. There's not a question of the week. Question of the live. So have you got any questions? Any questions at all? Deb's had one. What was the one? Oh, what do you? What? Deb, you should come on as well. Yeah, come on, come Deb. On. Come on down. Scooch, scooch. <laughs> All right, what's your what's your question? Right. You're not wearing a mic, and so you have to speak into the mind, mind. What do you do with your moisture packs from Puffle? What, what do you use your moisture packs for? Leave your comments down below. Put the comments in now. We can actually read them out. Loud. Oh, people are saying thank you. People are going to go on there. Well, okay, okay, answer the question first before you go. Answer the question very quickly. Um, but yes, I just want to say thank you to all of you. Um, I mean, you. You sort of didn't do very I much, did you? <laughs> I'm joking, more, I'm yeah. joking. It's lovely to have you here. And okay. um, Lucy, uh, oh, I can't, okay, okay. How long have the ladies been doing this? Don't know about <laughs> quite hours. a long while. Um, and oh, somebody said, Say hi to Deb. Listen at Unique Days Denmark. So, oh. hold on, hold on. I need to, oh, where's my mouse gone? Thank you, I did. Didn't get any work done today. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. um, no, how long have you ladies been doing it? Lucy, you've been in the industry a couple of years, haven't you? How many? About 20, yeah, 20 odd years. And yep. Julie, not quite so much. No, about six years working for Pioneer and then just kind of dabbled in it a little bit. And before that. Debs was kind of born into Qualitex, really. <laughs> <laughs> 33 years. You know, 33 so years. That's bonkers. Bonkers. I uh, didn't get any work. Actually, uh, uh, okay. I'll that get, last question. Very welcome. Wanted to ask Julie, would there still be a gap between the 24 inch deco bubble and the 16 inch latex stuffed with inflated no. and inflated inside? Not if you've taken the air out. Yeah, you've got a 
squeeze all the air out, make sure you get all the air out, either by rolling, like you did the rolling thing, I think, at one point, didn't you? But just mm -hmm. make sure there's no air, because if you've got air in it, then you'll get a gap. Perfect. Any other questions before we go? I started saying bye to everybody. And then, <laughs> um, so, yeah, nobody's answered the question of the week. Is Qualtech still hiring in the UK? Libby wants a job. <laughs> yeah, we've just hired somebody in the marketing department. There we are. Yeah, yeah good news. Um, so yeah, I think I think I think we're going to call it call yeah. it there. We're done. Play. So a big to thank you to everybody, um, and a big thank you to Alex. Come on, come on. Go, come, come on, Alex. Can you come on. <laughs> if anybody comments or anything, there's nothing we can do. We can't put it on the screen because Alex is going to be here for for a few seconds. So scoot this way. Come in. Come in. I don't know why I'm here, but hi. so Alex, <laughs> as you know, behind the scene, mainly for London. Um, so Bye, yeah, London. thank you. <laughs> Thank you, everybody, for watching. Um, thank you guys again. And uh, look forward to doing, hopefully, another one of these at some point in the near future. We'd love to know what you think of it. Please feel free to, to email me direct, greg at balloonmarket.co.uk. Um, tell me your thoughts, what we could do better. If there's anything you particularly liked, um, that would be really great feedback. But from all of us here, Alex has got to get back to, to, to turn it all off. Um, thank you so much. and. Yeah, have a great rest of the week. See you later. Bye. Bye. Thank you.